Like, I mean, I didn't fall asleep. I was like literally just because I didn't expect to have it. Um, yeah, so it, it kind of woke you up. You're like, I'm fucking playing this like all. Yeah, because well, I'm oh, I'm all stoked, like ready to have it and or ready yeah, to play so it. it. Alright, like, oh, Okay, it's all set up. What's going on, guys? Your boy Mindscape coming at you with your second, third, um, Madden 19 video. PS4, gonna do a pack opening. Welcome, my boy Jacob, aka What's Sandstorm. Up? He's gonna be hanging out with me for a little bit, bullshitting, keeping me company while I grind out some solos. And we are gonna jump straight into a bundle opening, and hopefully we can pull some nice cards. Um, so if anybody missed the first couple streams, uh, the first one kind of sucked. It was the game hadn't completely downloaded yet, and it was just kind of the intro to it. Um, what up, Gizmo? Um, the second one was actually all downloaded, and I streamed for a little while, but I was so tired that I wasn't prepared for it, and I wasn't ready to do it. Um, so I did some pack openings. I did, I grinded a few solos, so on and so forth, but I wasn't fully into it because I wasn't expecting it. So I'm a little bit more refreshed oh. today and ready to go and grind out some of these solos. Um, yeah. So that's it. We're going to jump straight into opening up some, or the bundle, basically, the premium gold pack bundle. <sighs> We're going to jump straight into that. <laughs> so 20 gold premium pack and a topper elite player, which is going to be a fucking 80, 81. I know. Thank you so much right now. Dude, the 80, 81 is like garbage right now, though. Hey, you know what? It works, though. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's still better than a fucking silver card for sure. I mean, hey, if you don't like it, go ahead and just, uh, you know, donate to the poor right now. Stupid. <laughs> you know, I ain't donating shit at the beginning of Madden. I gotta donate when I have when I have money. I don't have money. I got 20, 27,000 coins. That's garbage. <laughs> All right, so we're going to open up the topper nice. first and get the topper out of the way. And we're going to see what elite player we get. Julio Jones is on the cover of it, so I want Julio Jones. That's all I'm saying. Here we go. Oh, we get the pick. Or no. Oh. 84 champ Bailey legend, baby. Okay, so, oh. the, so it's an elite. Oh, it's an elite player pack. Okay, it wasn't an elite player. It was an elite player pack. So I got Champ Bailey, 84 Legend Corner. I'll take that for sure. Oh, I got another old elite. Deion Lewis, ex-New England Patriot. Now with Aww. the Titans, running back. Man, I've got like four like solid running backs. And I have yet, to, I have yet to even pull a defensive tackle. Oh, I think that was my first defensive tackle. So out of that elite player pack, I got two elites, 84 Champ Bailey and 82 Deion Lewis. Deion Lewis, mm, <gasps> We can check him out, like, real quick. We can compare him. He doesn't really have much. Uh, actually, he's got better speed. Not bad. I wish I pulled 88 Brady. <laughs> that would be dope. So, oh, yeah. man. So, Deion Lewis. Not bad. Not a bad card, but we don't need him. Champ Bailey, although, like, I do, I do believe we need a corner. I think. Okay, so he's our top corner. I, I dig that. So 84. We got an 84 corner, an 81 corner, and an 80 corner. So that's nice. Champ Bailey legend. I dig it. Let's go. All right. We got 20 gold premium packs to open up. I want some elites out of these bitches. So you got any? You got any calls? You got any players you think I'm gonna I'm gonna snag? One of my Man, son. Man, I I'm hope you snag Case Keenum. <laughs> what the fuck do I want a Case Keenum? He's probably like a, a 78 or some shit. I probably already Not have him. Not after last year. <laughs> yeah, he's still a 78, dude. Everybody's low this From... year, bro. Like, literally. Like, nobody's really that that super, super high. So. From what I heard, Case Keenum's doing pretty good with the like, Broncos right like, now. Like, let me put I'm kind of jealous. Let me put it this way. Like, Alvin Kamara 
who won Rookie of the Year last year, is only an 85. I mean, Alvin Kamara was a beast. So was Marshawn Lattimore, and they both they both only got 85. But all the players, like it, it's the beginning of Mutt this year, so yeah, it's all it's going to be lower. Oh yeah, I know. 80, 81s right now. That's what I'm saying. I just want elites out of these out of these gold packs. I just want a couple of, out of 20 gold packs. I want this early. I want mm, I want like three elites, and I'll be happy. Mm. Three, come on, three out of twenty, or one, or really one really nice you. one. You can be happy with really give you. You shut up. All right, let's go. <laughs> First pack. Mm. Silvers for days. Oh my God, four silvers for reals. Ouch. Deshaun Kaiser. Oh, he got traded already. I didn't know he got traded to Green Bay. Two gold players. Ooh, a 79 kicker. A rookie kicker. Oh, it's a Vikings rookie kicker. Daniel Carlson. Uh, rookie kicker. Yeah. 79 yeah. overall. Rookie kicker in the draft. Why yeah. did we draft a kicker? I don't know. I mean, let's look. So, anybody doesn't know, this is uh, Sandstorm's team, the Vikings, and he's not bandwagon. We've explained this last year. Go back and watch old videos if you're confused. Uh, let's see. It doesn't, doesn't say... Yeah, I wish it said it doesn't say like what he was drafted, like what round or anything like that. It just says quarter. I mean, it was maybe probably like the fifth or sixth undrafted. round or some shit, though. You know what I mean? So. I mean, maybe he was undrafted. I don't know. I wouldn't spend it like if, if it was my team. I wouldn't be spending a draft pick on a kicker. Well, dude, I'd how are you gonna get kickers? Pick. Kickers don't just appear out of fucking thin air. You have to draft them. Free, free agency. Yeah, but kickers get old and shit. What up, young buck? Kickers get old, <laughs> dude. Like, come on, man. All right, moving on. So we got a Viking kicker and Deshaun Kaiser, who I didn't know, I guess because they drafted uh, Baker Mayfield that they traded Kaiser to the Packers. He only played one year. He was a rookie last year. That's crazy. All right. That was first pack. Not bad. I got a kicker upgrade, so I'll take that. I just want, like, upgrades, honestly, to my squad. Another rookie card. Ooh, an upgrade player. 68 cornerback Marcus Peters. I like it. A power up. Power up Marcus Peters. I like them power ups. I'm going to do big things with them things. And 77 Tremont Williams. So we got a power up. We got a kicker. I'll take it so far. Boo. Another rookie. A bunch of silvers. Oh, an elite! Oh, oh. <laughs> it's your favorite player. It basically moved y'all into the playoffs, like even further. This play, this My one player. player. Mm, I'm being sarcastic, but oh. he literally this this player. All right, let's let's do some trivia. This player advanced single-handedly advanced your Minnesota Vikings further into the playoffs last year and he doesn't even play for Minnesota. What's his name? Case Keenum. And he doesn't play for the Vikings. And he single handedly advanced y'all in the playoffs last year. Oh, Aaron Rodgers. Stupid. Advanced y'all. Like Marcus Williams, the free safety for oh, the yeah, Saints yeah, yeah. because of that missed tackle. <laughs> he single handedly You know what? Like, I do not acknowledge the Saints as a team. Like I No, but what I'm him. saying is that's the dude that missed the tackle. Yeah, I know. That like uh, that on on Stefan Diggs that like let the Vikings go forward. <laughs> that's karma for the year of Brett Favre. So we got two two core rookies and one elite eighty one Marcus Williams. Alright, so we got one eighty one. That's one elite. I don't do we can I like it. I've got a bunch of free safeties. Oh, another power up. Let's get it. Xavier Rhodes, Minnesota Vikings corner. Ooh. What's with the Vikings? Vikings? Are you like bringing me like all kind of Viking like karma and shit or something here? I got Viking kicker. I got Marcus what Williams. <laughs> I got Marcus Williams who advanced y'all in the playoffs. I got a Viking kicker and now I got a power up Xavier Rhodes, Viking cornerback. Like everything's been Viking. Good luck. Everything's been Vikings like pack so far. 
All right, we got 16 more. I like those power ups though. My ball. Man, I haven't played too many challenges though. Come on. I fall off too quick. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be sitting here burning through these challenges. I got nothing in that pack. 15 more. Already open up a uh -huh. Oh, we got a rookie. Yeah. Three gold. I got to six to even get the game. Seventh, buddy. Seventh. Another rookie. Another rookie. Bunch of gold players. Yeah, gold player packs. One elite so far, though, man. I should have remembered that you bring me bad luck on packs. <laughs> I totally forgot about that shit last year. <laughs> this is a bad time for me to be opening up a fucking... Oh, elite! <laughs> hey, it's my first defensive tackle, though. Corey Le Leggett from the Chargers. I'll take that. Because I have no defensive tackles. He's my first defensive tackle, and he's an elite. Yeah, I should have totally remembered that you did fuck me over on PAX. Every time I'm on a stream with you, like last year at the beginning, you just like, it'd be like, you get a choice between a 90 and a 99 player. And like, if I'm on stream with you, I get the fucking 90. <laughs> I'm all, yeah, let me get top shelf. And it's like, no. Jacob's on stream, you get nothing. <laughs> So we got two elites, 80, 81. We got a bunch of rookies and two power ups so far. Another rookie. A couple more golds. Oh, another elite! Blake Bortles, 80 overall, Blake Bortles. So we got three elites. Three elites and nine packs. But nobody like really, really good. All 80, 80 ones. Another rookie. The card art is pretty, like, the, you know, like when they open up and everything like that. It looks pretty cool. Yeah. It, looks, it looks pretty dope. Especially like the specialty cards, like the power-ups or the, le like the legend cards or like specialty mm -hmm. ones. They're pretty cool. So we've opened up half the packs, half this bundle. Got three elites. Oh, another power up. This will be Mario Davis, middle linebacker for the Jets. Another core rookie. Another core rookie. Oh, another defensive tackle, though. It's not an elite, but it's a 78, so I'll take that. All right. Let's go. Give me some pack luck. We need some... Mindscape pack luck. Oh, an elite pack. Oh, right and Vinnie Curry, 80 overall. Damn, man. All these like 80, 80 ones. I just got a 92 height and hurt. Whatever, that's Madden 18. We don't talk about Madden 18. Madden 18 don't exist. Madden 18 don't, Madden 18 don't exist anymore. Why do you gotta hurt me like this? So, what's that? So that's five elites so far we've pulled. All 8081, a bunch of core rookies, and four power ups. Nothing too spectacular. We did get the 83 overall champ Bailey. It was pretty dope. I'm saying, young buck, I need that fire pull, bro. I need that one that makes me like scream on mic and shit and get all hyped. All right, we got seven more. Never having Jacob on a stream again. You never have Jacob on a stream all day. Okay, Matthew Stafford. Another core rookie. Hmm, six more to go. Burn through fourteen of these hoes. Come on, man. Let's get it. One time. One time. 
I know. See, that's why you you fucking suck. <laughs> Cause you're all like no times. You're not even like I got my my subs and shit on here, like telling me like let's get that fire pull and good luck. And you're like no times, we'll do it. And you're on mic. I'm need to be on mic with them. <laughs> you fucking jinx shit. All right, nah, you get like two best ones. So no yeah, but it's I'd like fun. to I'd like to start off with some nice shit too. Not have to fucking build like I'll fucking take forever. All right, last five. Another core rookie. Another core rookie. Come on, give me an elite, baby. Give me one elite. All right, four more to go. And we're going to get into some, start grinding some solos and shit like that. I did win a squads game this morning before work. That was pretty dope. Really? Yeah. I actually found, I actually found some people on, because there's not many, many like people on PS4, like, right now, so. Like, it, it, like those bots, like, last time? Nah, these were people. But the funny thing was, is like, it was, one dude was the coach. They had a 68 overall, or 61 overall team. So they basically just got the free team that they start with and then went, like, straight into squads. And the dude was, one dude was on defense. I was running offense. We won, like, 28 nothing. But, uh, like, the coach, the head coach, he sat there on my receiver, and he didn't play, like, the entire fucking game. He just sat there and took the win. For free, basically. But I, but it sucked because he stayed on a receiver and didn't fucking move. So every time I did a passing route, it was literally like, you know, he just, oh, that stand, was horrible. He'd just stand there fucking. You know. So I just opened a blockbuster supporting pack, which contains one ninety-two and ninety overall blockbuster players, one gold and better player, and three silver better players. Yeah, I opened up like nine million of them last year. Dude, it didn't even contain one ninety to ninety something overall. Yeah, it does. It's, it did. Yeah, it has to. <laughs> I swear to God. All right, two more of these bitches left. Come on, where's my elite, bro? Am I really not it. gonna get another elite? There we go, one more elite. Fucking Brandon Williams left end. All eighty, eighty-one, bro. All right, last one. I'm saving the rest of these coins. Random shit as I level up. Or rest of the points. Rest, rest of the points. Corley. Oh, that's. Oh, TJ Watt right outside linebacker elite. Damn, man. That's JJ Watt's brother. All 80 81. So I got like seven elites. Seven or eight elites. All 80 81s. Huh. But Not I did bad. get some. I did get some players that like boost my position. I need a center desperately, but I did not get. And then I needed defensive tackle because I don't have any defensive tackle, and I needed a right outside linebacker, which I got in T.J. Watt. So let's upgrade, generate best lineup. Eighty-one overall. Let's go. Big time, baby. All right. I take it. Let's go. We're pretty much almost all elite across the board, except for 178, 179. Oh, I did get an upgrade on my center, which is nice. Be right back. Nobody cares. Nobody's going to miss you. <laughs> we got Tyreek Hill. Speed, 91 speed. All right, so we need to take Lee Smith out. And we need to put in, um, what's his face? Um, Melvin Gordon. It'll probably drop me back down. But, yep, drop me back down to an 80. But that's okay. All right, we're close, man. We are really close to full elite. We need a we need an elite fullback, elite center, right guard, right tackle, a elite left outside linebacker, 
And then uh, elite defensive tackle number two. Man, let's go. The squad is looking pretty legit. We got some legends like on the team. Sean Taylor. Like, okay. I'm liking this so far. I'm liking this. Is Morgan Burnett? Okay, we need to compare Morgan Burnett and Sean Taylor. Oh, we definitely need to put Sean Taylor in. Acceleration, speed, tackling, whatever. Play rec is better. Pursuit's better. Zone's better. Man coverage is worse, but I don't really play man with my safeties. And then hit power is just about the same. So we are definitely going to sub in Sean Taylor at strong safety over Morgan Burnett. Because they're both 81s, so. That's what I'm talking about. All right, team looks good. Oh, special teams. I forgot I got a kicker, too. I got to upgrade on my kicker. So I got two core rookie kickers. <laughs> Daniel Carlson, 79. And a punter for the Raiders. Let's check it. Let's compare him. See how much of an upgrade he was from Randy Bullock. Hmm. 84 and 70, 84. His kick accuracy is worse, but he's got better kick power. So, all right. So this thing's going to go a little bit quicker, but. Hey, Brenda, I actually got, um, I got this from Mutt Rewards. They sent me a promo code yesterday and gave me the game for free. Um. And that's how I'm able to play it on PS4. Everybody else is playing it. For the most part, everybody else is playing it and streaming it on Xbox. Because Xbox has a deal, or EA has a deal with, uh, with Microsoft. Oh, my son is on. What's up, kiddo? Everybody, uh, Microsoft has a deal with EA. And they, some specific picked out people like pro gamers and high-end YouTubers uh, got what's called early access, and that's how they're playing it. Um, I was actually one of the lucky few PS4 people that got picked to play it. I also got picked to play the beta uh, early this month. So. I still hate you for it. And so I played the beta, and then they gave me this yesterday, which I wasn't prepared for. And so now I'm able to play it. All right. So we are an 81 overall squad. Well, we're an 80, but... Are you kidding me? Already? 81 overall, baby. We're almost all elite across the board. Ugh. We could be an 81, but I put Melvin Gordon in at fullback just for speed and passing out of the backfield. Because I, I only have a 72 fullback right now anyway, so... I'm going to come in. I'm going to be a 60 overall for a good week. Nah. <laughs> so 12 hours in I'm an 81 overall <laughs> let's go I dig it maybe some of that luck will rub off on me ah uh, Brendy got legend tier yeah I mean I, I had legend tier too like I don't know it's it's basically it's few and far between from what I from what I understand Brenda it's this is super rare like, to have this on PlayStation right now. Like, you can go into the auction and, and literally... I mean, I'm sure there's more today than there were yesterday. But if you go to the auction house, which is where I, I live, basically. Because that's where I build my squad. I love sniping and everything like that. You go to, like, just say 84, 85, which isn't too, too great, but it ain't horrible. You can see right there... It was only 22 cards up for auction. No, we didn't mess up right away. 84, 85s. So, n not a lot of people like on the auction block like right now. Even the yeah, 80. You checking my email? Even the 80, 81s, like, like you can see here. It's even the 80, 81s. They're not even like full. The the the. The whole selection is not even full yet. So, yeah. Kind of crazy. 
I was double checking my email, like maybe I got it too. Like hopefully. You didn't get shoot. You didn't get nothing. You're welcome, brother. Subscribe to your boy. Give me a like on the channel. See, y'all need to like give me likes too. See, I noticed that like I get a lot of people like watching this and everything like that, and I love it. But like nobody likes my like still see like I had to just like my own video. You know how sad it is to have to like your own video. <laughs> it's it's sad. And you got like eight people watching and like nobody likes your video. It's like boo. Ooh, it's Jimmy like, Garoppolo. Man, I'd like, to like Jimmy Garoppolo. It's like uh liking your own post on Facebook. Yeah, dude. Like, like I, I, like, yeah, it feels it feels bad, bro. I'm like, I don't wanna like like my own shit. Like <laughs> it's like, can y'all like my stuff, please? Subscribe. Oh, come on, man. Don't beg. <laughs> yeah, I'm begging. Subscribe to your boy. Give me some likes. I got like four subscribers yesterday from streaming, so it's pretty cool. I appreciate all of them. See, the more likes and subscribers that you get, the more likely you're going to do giveaways and whatnot. So. No, I'm not. That's not necessarily true. I want to do... I want to make a veterans pack, man. I want to... I want to pull one of these veterans, but I gotta make an elite, uh, uh, an elite card, and it's like so sketch to make an elite card. It's scary. I know because like they're so expensive these cards. But I don't know. Should I make one? What do you think? Let me see. Let me see like what? Cause I made a gold. So this year, I don't know if anybody knows, but like this year. The uh, gold car, uh, gold gold tokens and silver tokens, they are not auctionable. So you are not gonna be able to buy gold. You're gonna have to make them. So which tells me like gold players this year and silver players this year are probably gonna be more expensive. And there is no such thing as bronze players except for the core ones that you get at the beginning. The ones that Madden feels bad for you, so they just give it to me. But yeah, dude, like you can't even like make uh like the tokens, like you know how they had team tokens, like Patriot team tokens and you know, like whatever. Like gold tokens and whatever. Like you it's no longer by team, it's just gold players, high low, and that's it. But you can't buy them on the auction block. You have to make them. So Oh. So like it's like right now it's it's to earn to make a silver token, it's five low silver, five high silver. A uh, gold one is five uh, uh, low gold, five high gold, and the elite. Right now, this is the sketchy part. Is I have it and I can make it, but it's one eighty four plus overall card, which I don't know. That seems really pricey to me. I'd give it another week or so and then see about doing that. Cause... I know, but I want one now. Yeah, but do you want to risk the team that you have? Who cares? You know me. <laughs> Zero fucks given. <laughs> I'm lo I'm just, all I'm basically looking at is like, who could I give up? See, because I'm looking at it right now, and if I make an elite token, I can give up Melvin Gordon and still have Alvin Kamara. I can give up Melvin Gordon, and it's not going to affect my overall. And then I can also give up Deion Lewis, who I just pulled, because he's another running back, and it's not going to affect my overall. Like I said, I got a lot. Of, I'm deep in running backs, and then 80-81s. I got. I got. I have more 80-81s than the damn auction block has, and I've got double Devonte Parker, which is nice. So that's an easy just give up. And then I got a Jerry Hughes that's not even in my starting lineup. And Marcus Williams. That's actually I'd probably give up Marcus Williams because he's uh Um I have a ton of free safeties. I think I'm gonna do it. What do you think? Let me check out I think you should hold on to him and hand him to me. You're stupid. I could use him. <laughs> so I can make look for handouts. I can make a a veterans player. I don't know what the highest one you can get right now is, but flashback players are look like they're going to be way too expensive. One elite. I can make another gold and some silver. Make a flashback? 
How much are flashbacks? I don't know. The whole thing is making the like, fucking elite token. That's what's like basically gonna kick kick me in the nuts. But <laughs> all right, let's go to the auction house. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna search by flashback players and veteran players. I'm gonna see. I think obviously the flashback players are gonna be worth more because um, they cost more to make. So all right. Veteran players, there's one, only one on the auction block, and 85 left end Chris Long for 90k. And then flashback players, there is, oh shit, there's actually a decent amount of flashback players. Man, some of these are so pricey. Marcus Joyner, Danny Trevathan. Landon Collins would be nice. Pierre Garçon, Tyler Eifert. The lowest one's 80, 88K. Whoo! That's pricey. Mm hmm. Well, then after that, it's 116, 140, 135, 144, 175, all the way up to Matt Ryan. If you pull an 80, so it looks like 88's the highest. It goes, it looks like 87, 88. So, regardless of what we pull, we want the 88. So we'd want Danny Trevathan, uh, Stephon Gilmore, Lamarcus Joyner, or turn Matt, around and sell him. Or, or Matt Ryan, yeah, and then turn around and sell that bitch and and make 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 some bank. Oh man, okay, let's check the fat boys because there's a another one that's called heavyweights. No heavyweights are on the on the on the block. Hmm. That means nobody's made a heavyweight yet. You got something against fat people or something? <laughs> no, the heavyweights are there's a it's a whole new set that's basically um they um let me see what it's called, what they call it. Uh high performance offensive linemen, defensive linemen, and fullbacks. So O line, D line and fullbacks. High performance, I don't know. And it's called heavyweights. I don't know. You fat bastards. <laughs> Trade in mutt tokens to earn a quick sell between 1,000 and 100,000. And it's a gold token and three silvers. Fuck that. Wheel of training. Trade in your mutt tokens to earn a quick sell between 50 and 500 training. What do you got to do? Man, those are pricey. I mean, maybe not later on. They won't be that bad. But right now, that's too pricey for that stuff. All right. I'm going to go balls deep. And we are going to make a flashback player. Oh, this is going to suck. So I need one gold, three <laughs> silver, and an elite. Ooh. AIDS. So what would you recommend? Like any high player I get, just throw them in the auction board for the first couple of weeks? No, I, rem I recommend you do the exact opposite of what I'm doing and hold on to your players. Ooh. Hold on to all your cards for like a month, literally. And that goes for everybody else. Hold on to y'all's players for like a solid month. Nah. They don't get tips. I get tips. Well, I everybody get gets tips. tips. They're my subscribers. They get tips. <laughs> all right, we're making this. We're making this. Oh, God. I'm, I'm so sketchy about Scared. this right now. Yeah, dude. I just don't, I don't know. I'm going to be happy regardless. I'm going to be happy regardless because I'm going to pull an 87 or an 80, 88, which at this point in the game, an 87, 88 is a beautiful thing. All right. We've done it. We already made our. We made the elite token. That was the most painful part. Seventy, seventy-four gold. We only need one of these, I think. The Lord. I'll give you all the cheapest fucking one I can find. That's not a rookie. Oh no. One, oh, two, three, intercepted too. Four. Oh my god, he's gonna bring it all the way back. Five. We don't be talking about Madden Madden. 18. Madden 18. Madden 18's not a thing anymore. Look, man, Madden yeah. 18 is still a thing. All y'all are. All y'all is losers. <laughs> Madden 18 is a thing until the 6th. Just because no. you got Mad Magic, you don't mean you got a dog on us. Yeah, it absolutely means that.
Three, four, and five. There's my gold token. All right, there's two gold tokens. Oh, Jacob, I'm fucking scared. Man, if I pull Matt Ryan, bro, oh, I'll be so happy. Matt <laughs> Ryan selling for 200k? 800, bro. What? Matt Ryan, 88 overall, is going for 800k. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah exactly. You better start donating. To what? To the poor. Bitch, you don't even have the, you won't have the game for <laughs> five, six more days. Actually, I think it's five. Four. So it's second, right? Yeah, so four more, four more days. Four days. Because I'm getting it on the, on the sixth. You get it on the seventh. There's a there's a early release on the sixth. It's I the, used that. Where I bought it from. Yeah, you get it at, at, at midnight on. at midnight on the sixth. That's when you're nope. at 9 p.m. Really? They're selling that at 9 p.m., huh? Yeah. You go in, you pick up your chi you pick up the ticket so they can call your group number and then you go and pick it up. Wow, you gotta like take a ticket and shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, they give you your group number. Like I already have my receipt, it's all paid for. They can so kiss I was my... kinda hoping you'd You walk in there what you need to do is you need to walk in there and you need to be like, Hey bro. I already got all this shit. Fuck y'all. Oh my god, the second Okay, doubles. Second. One two Three, four, five doubles. I got doubles. I like it. I had five doubles. All right. Here we go. Anybody's on, I need y'all to, like, give me some love here because I'm finna make a flashback player, and this is really fucking stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, this is painful. Oh, I got to make another silver token. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know it was four silver tokens, man. Four silver tokens? Fucking A. I don't want to get rid of my silver people already. I don't care about my silver people. Fuck them. Those are Jacob. <laughs> those are Jacob. Don those are Jacob donating people. I want my rookies. I need to keep my rookies because they go into sets, but all the other dudes can eat a nut. One, two, three, yeah. four, five. Go on. Let's score again. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, man, come on. Give me a high. I need high players, man. One, two, three, yeah. four. Right. Restart. Five. Okay. We just made the last one. All right, Jacob, you ready for this shit? Yeah. Add to flashbacks. Ooh, you ready? Flashback pack. Oh, man. Here we go. It's gonna hurt. <laughs> Bro. I, I didn't say nothing. I didn't say nothing bad. I just want an 88, man. I mean, it's an 80. I'm praying for you. Come on. Let me the get it. The better you do, the better I do. Let me get an 88. Exactly. The better I do, see, all, everybody needs to be pulling for me. Because the better I do, like, the happier I am, which means the more I donate, the more I'm, like, helping people out and shit like that. All right. Let's do this shit. Oh, sketchy. Come on. Matt Ryan, 88. Here we go. I'm close my eyes. I can't look for you, so. Oh, the animation's dope. Fuck, man, that sucks! What happened? What'd you get? I got an 87 overall wide receiver, Pierre Garcon. An 87? 87. That's not bad. It's bad. He's got 80 fucking 3 speed. It's bad. That's not bad. You're stupid. It's garbage. My 83 overall Tyreek Hill has the same freaking um, um, salary cap rank, which means he, he plays just as good, if not better. Fuck, that sucks. My nuts. I can't edit my too fast. Oh man, that's so sad. All right, oh well. How much does he go for in the auction? House? We tried. Um, let me look. 
Fuck, it'd have been so nice to pull an 88, man. Like Madden already this year, dude. They're doing me dirty. Doing me dirty. Because you're rubbing it in. He goes for 175 right now. That's not bad. Put him up there for 170. No. I'm keeping all my players, dude. I need five tickets to enter this. How much are tickets? How much is five tickets? All right. Let's plug them in. Man. Man. Generate best oh, cool. lineup. Best lineup overall. Best team overall. <laughs> it didn't even raise my overall, dude. That sucks. Now I got Squam Barkley as my backup running back. Let's see how good I can do in a rank rank draft. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. Oh. Giants, Jets, or the Rams? Okay. Oh, All right. I mean, I'm happy. <sighs> I'm lying. I'm not happy. You said you have Alvin Kamara. Mm hmm He's one of my best. So do I now. He's my best, um, like, my highest, like, core elite card. He's an 85 overall. Well, like, core elite. Because I have, like, oh, no, I have LaMarcus Joyner. He's an 85 as well. But I have that 87 Pierre Garçon. That's Andy my highest, Watkins. My highest card. I'll take Sammy Watkins. Alright. Philip Rivers or Matt Ryan? I'm going to choose Andy Dalton. Hmm. Hold on one second. I'll be right back. All right, we're back. I got an 84 overall team right now. You have a what? 84 overall team. 85. 80? Never mind. You have an 84 overall team in Madden I did, 18. Yeah. I'm doing the whole rank draft. What the fuck? Oh, you're doing that. I got you. I was like, yeah. what the fuck? <laughs> Come on, you think I'm that bad? Ah, oh, of course. Shaquille Griffin comes in right after I got two points. All right, I'm going to go in and I'm going to try to play uh, squads on uh, hard level, which is all Madden Eleven. level, which is going to be rough. Let's see if we, guess, see if we can get some people on... I'm seriously mad at you right now. Like, I'm happy for you, but I'm mad at you. At <laughs> like, I want to play so badly. Shit, everybody does. <laughs> shit, I did. If I didn't have this shit, I would have been like... Just like everybody else, like, just fiending to, like, play. So I got an 81 overall team, an 81 overall offense, 81 overall defense. I like it. Nice, solid, across-the-board team. Not bad. Oh. 81, 81, so 81. Sick. 
I feel like I need to go for a right guard, though. I don't have a right guard. PA guy song. <laughs> Man, I would have loved to have had that 88 Matt Ryan, dude. That would have been hella dope. To be honest, like, this uh, Pierre Garçon was, like, one of the least one, like, probably the least one I wanted. So I can either keep a 91 overall Barry or give him up and put him, I guess, at left, at left linebacker and putting Cam Chancellor as a safety. I feel like I need another defense attack. I already have one. Nah. My line isn't bad. My D line ain't. I got like two seventies and two nineties. Two ninety five. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about your D but, line, dude. Like, you never worry about your O line, your offensive line, or your defensive line. You worry about secondary players, corners, linebackers, and then you worry about running backs, wide receivers, and quarterbacks. You don't mess. I, mean, with, I did this know. all wrong. Yeah, you don't mess with offensive line. You can win that with, like, 70, 80 overall offensive line. No, I'm an 89 overall. That's not bad. This, this is going to be bad. Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm going to get a get a squad going, squad challenge going. Nobody's here. That sucks. Not everybody has the game right now. <laughs> I know. Well, I got one earlier, right before I went to work. I got one for uh, one more week. How long were you at work? Like two hours? Mm-hmm. Literally. <laughs> I didn't feel good. She got you on salary, then. She. <laughs> you been here for two hours. I some, own the bitch. What are you talking in? about? <laughs> Uh, each you complete each subject from um, earn series trophies. Oh, so you have to play a medium. Win each of three weekly squad challenges to receive four additional squad Ugh. CPU regular season all pro four minute quarters. This motherfucker has three ninety nine over. Fuck. Oh, he's a Cowboys fan too. That's the worst. That is the worst. Ooh, they have a Side season Cowboy fans. A season squad versus the computer that you can play. Hmm. I don't want to do that. Let's see if I can get a medium. Because I don't think anybody... Wa that. The people that are on here, I don't think they want to play in hard yet because they don't have the team to probably do it. They'll play in hard. <laughs> well, actually, they probably don't have the the skills to do it. They pro Even if you had, like, a, an 80 overall team or an 81 overall team, you at least have to have skill to, like, still do it. You know what I mean? Yeah. So. Because right, we'll you're playing in all Madden level. Like, so the computer's going to be playing like a bat out of hell. I'm expecting this person to choke just for the fact that he has a cowboy, so. Man, come on. I don't want to sit here and play easy. You're going to make me do freaking... Uh, solos. I don't feel like doing solos like right from the jump right now. I mean, I've already been doing them, but... That's thing if you do solos, you should get... Yeah, I mean, I'm going to do the solos and stuff like that. I'm going to do them today, but... I wanted to get, like, there's a challenge in here that, like, in the Muck Squad's challenges where you beat uh, an easy, a medium, and a hard, and you get some stuff, and I want to, I wanted to get it out of the way, but I can't catch anybody, like, playing, and I'm even putting it as play as any, I'm not even saying, like, I want to be offense or defense. Alright, I'll give it till two minutes, and if not, then I'll just go grind solos. I don't think this person knows how to really play. You just got Ezekiel Elliott, really. This guy is way too into his Cowboys. Jesus. You still there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. <laughs> 
You got me to quiet. Yeah, I'm responding to a text. <clears throat> okay, two minutes up. Fuck that shit. <laughs> This guy can't play offense. Nobody's watching me. Nobody subscribed to me. Nobody liked my video but me. <laughs> I did. <laughs> you did, you liar. I haven't even looked at it yet. That's what I'm saying. So don't tell me you did. I will in a minute. Well, after you're done. You need to be liking all my damn videos. I do like all your videos. Most of them. Nice. I don't think I've watched the last few. Yeah. I don't get notifications. Don't blame me. That's why you hit that bell, buddy. There you go. I had that in your intro. I do. Make sure you hit that bell. <laughs> I'd be telling people. Well, I'm, uh, this guy Gizmo, like he's been like on my stream and he's been like helping out like while I've been doing stuff and he's been telling people to subscribe and hit the like button and do all this stuff because I always forget to say all that stuff. He's been doing it. It's been pretty dope. He's helped out a lot. But I helped him get some okay. like rookie premiere like players and stuff. For... All right, we're gonna go into. God. I wonder Jeez. solo battles. Seasons. And eh, we'll just do solo challenges. Fuck it. Let's go. Alright, so we've got 7 of 83 done, 3 of 10 done, and 0 of 10 done. Let's go keep rolling with the campaigns. Make it quick and easy. Alright, allow, allow less than 10 yards, less than 5 yards. What, on this, on this drive. Alright, so we've got to allow less yeah. than 5 yards on this drive. So if they get more than 5 yards, restart. Oh, so there's a glitch, Jacob, that... Um, you know how, like, if you mess up a solo, you just, like, like, when, when it goes back to the screen, you can just, like, restart it, you know? Yeah. Well, there's a glitch on the, on the PlayStation. I'm sure they're gonna fix it, hopefully, by the time it actually, well, like, releases. Because it's a huge deal. If you restart your solo, um, you, all the timeouts for you and the other team disappear. Wait, all the timeouts are, like, gone? You don't see yeah, them? yeah. Like, you don't have them anymore. So, like, right, say so it's a challenge where, you know, you've got, like, 30 seconds to score, right and you're at your own 10-yard line, and you need those timeouts, right? If you end up having to restart... Um, if you end up having to restart the uh, challenge, those challenges, or those... those uh, those things, the, the timeouts disappear, and like you don't, you don't get them. You don't have them. Fumbled. This guy is really starting to be on my nerves. All right, so I got a sack like right off the bat. So we're looking, we're looking solid right now. That's really difficult to do in today's NFL with all these gazelles running around that you're trying to cover in the secondary. Coming up now on a second and fifteen. Literally on my nerves right now. They'll run it now out of the gun. And not much room to operate it, so get this up only to about the 41. Picked up one yard, so I Just can't allow him game. nine yards on this play. Yards still Let's go. Third down. What do you think? Nine hurdles? There defensively, something we might see more That's of in the fourth quarter. I think we'll see eight. a lot of it in, in the difference At between most. that and a pass blitz. Pass blitz just trying to get to the Wait, are you playing rookie or hard? I'm playing rookie. Oh, I say he gets fucking back again. No, I'm just doing a challenge. I'm just doing challenges right now. Uh, okay. I don't know. I think it, it's probably it's early, so it's probably on rookie. We've watched this a long time, and they'll just progressively get harder. Why you call play action? Yeah, yeah. So I got my extra 1,500 points for this. Coach explained to me years ago that for some teams, that's how they have to do with pass protection and their line blocking. But to me, it seems silly. Yeah, well, they're silly, and it leads to a play action sack. He gets this. So yeah, so I'm about to pop into my buddy's party. Getting off of you? Yeah. Yeah. Second. Oh, I just got my first kick return for a touchdown. Or punt return for a touchdown. 
Tyreek Hill, baby. <laughs> Let's go. All right, man. Well, yeah. Yeah, right, I'll catch you later. All right, bro. Of course. All right, later, bro. So that was my boy, Sandstorm. Um, friend of mine in real life. Cool cat. So we got a couple sacks on that. I dug it. Silver defense is back. back. Yeah. Mm. Shit, I should have looked at the nat players when I was making these. When I made those gold tokens. Alright, score touchdown, one drive. And there is no bonus. So, Alright. Let's go. Score touchdown. This should make those other challenges easier too. Combine training and require players upgrade and get the best version available. Upgrade your players. Use the new player upgrade system. Power them up to the best version available. Doodle-loop. Doodle-loop. Draft class creator. If you can imagine it, you can draft it. Nice. You're not going to be able to win the game, but don't go down without a fight. Get some more points <laughs> on the board how? before time expires. Stuck TV. So I'm able to do this because and I explained this like a million times. I'll get though. Um, Mutt Rewards sent me an email yesterday. So if you do Mutt Rewards, if you do all of that they sent me an email yesterday giving me the game for free and i had already pre-ordered it like everybody else and they sent me a beta i was a beta tester for mad 19 and they sent that earlier this year and then uh, oh that's a bad pass um and I gave him some feedback on some glitches and, and stuff like that. And then yesterday at around noon, they sent me, and I had already pre-ordered the copy. I got a refund from PlayStation. Um, they sent me a copy of the game. Uh, Ooh. Ooh. Oh, Jimmy Graham, though. Oh, that's not you, Jimmy Graham. Uh, they sent me a copy of the game for free and i thought it was still going to be i still have to wait till the seventh or whatever and i actually uh was able to play it right now so pretty fucking dope no lie like i'm pretty stoked about it so yeah so i've just been grinding out challenges doing a few videos i've only had it about i've only like had it about 12 hours i've only got about maybe like five hours of gameplay in so all right, we leveled up. Level 13. Reward training pack. Give my training pack then. So, yeah, it's pretty dope, man. Give me 500 training points. Maybe like 50. Oh, you get to pick? Oh, there's two levels. Oh shit, I gotta see who I already have. I don't have Yonda, I know that. I don't have Cleo Mac. I do have Peters. I don't have Kenny Clark. I do have Demario Davis and Marcus Peters already. Um I don't know that Marcel Yonda looks pretty solid. Might have to do that Marcel Yonda. Nice, Antonio. You got a 68 overall? That's what's up. I mean, you just started playing it yesterday, yeah? Like, you just got the... you got? Did you get the early release? Yeah, I'm thinking Cleo Mac, too. It's either going to be Cleo Mac or Marshall Yonda. Let me, let me see who I have at left end, though, already. So I get to Marcus Lawrence at left end already. Man, look at that speed on Cleo Mac, though, on a 68 card. 
69 speed. And it's going to be a beast card, I think. How are you going to be on Madden 19 on PS4 in a couple days? You mean on the 7th? Like for the early release? Yeah, let's go with Cleo. And then points or what? 25 training points. That's what's up. So we got Cleo Mac power up and 25 training points. That's what's up. I dig it. Oh, we got to put these level masters. I think I have two of these now. I'm going to back out of this really quick. Um, I think I have uh, two of these level masters. They... So your level master this year is Ricky Williams. And it goes into... Oh, shit, I got 25 training points. There no. I can't sell this introduction thing. It's pissing me off. Did you play the stuck? Did you get to play the? Uh, did you play the beta? How come I'm not able to? So do I have to go to the Ricky Williams and do this, I guess? That's stupid. Um, did you play the beta stuck? Jimmy, uh, I got it from Mutt, uh, Mutt Rewards. They gave me an email yesterday for a promo code, gave me the game for free, and downloaded it, and I'm able to play. Very few people, very, very few people are able to play on PS4 right now. Every All the YouTube streamers and everything like that, unless you're like a pro player, pro players have PS4. Uh... Very, very few, even like high end, like YouTube players, like have or YouTube streamers or whatever, have PS4. They're, they're playing on Xbox because of the early access, because of the deal that EA has with Microsoft that allowed everybody to play yesterday. But I got it from Mutt Rewards, luckily. And I got the beta test a month ago, too, to play. It's pretty dope. Oh, that sucks, stuck. Let's find Ricky Williams. Where the hell is he? He's only like a 70 or there he is. So I guess we have to go to his card and then boost it like... Yeah, that's crazy. You just can't select it. You just can't select the card. All right, so at least this will make him a 72 overall. Level him up a couple. So the next one's 73. And strength and speed. So the next one will... I don't... But this one, as far as you can see, I think like once you get to like level 50, I would assume level 50... You get this 92 overall master, uh, Ricky Williams. Are you, do you have Mutt Rewards? Like, my advice to, like, everybody, because Mutt Rewards gives you, like, free shit throughout the year, too. Like get mutt rewards and you don't have to like buy packs and like everything like that get mutt rewards and um get to like legendary and um yeah i mean that's how i got it like i didn't ask for it i didn't ask for the i didn't ask for the beta i didn't uh 
or this. They just sent me an email. I randomly like looked at my phone and there it was. I was like, oh shit. Like I said, I had actually bought the Hall of Fame edition. I already had it like waiting like on my PS4 when they sent me the code. So I actually had to contact PlayStation and tell them, hey, my son accidentally <laughs> bought <laughs> Madden because he overheard me saying that I wanted it. And they gave me a refund for it. So they gave me like it was like $77 back. And then I used this code, re-downloaded the game, and I'm actually able to play. So definitely do your Mutt Rewards if y'all aren't in Mutt Rewards. Because every pack that you open, like, goes towards your status. And people keep saying, like, like uh, legendary... Shit, I didn't see what the goal was for this. It'll show up. Uh, everybody keeps saying, oh, I'm legendary on Mutt Rewards, and I didn't get it. And, and like, very few people get this this early. Like, it just doesn't really happen. So, but, I mean, it does happen, obviously. Because I got the beta test and this, this year, so. And also, there is actually a tier that is unbeknownst to a lot of people. Because people keep saying, oh, I'm legend, you know, status, if everything like that. If you go to Mutt Rewards, I think it's MuttRewards.com or like whatever. It'll actually tell you, and you look at your, your, um like packs and like status where it's like you know rookie all pro legend or whatever it is there's like three the tiers Chicago there's actually a third one mine's actually black it has like the legend star like the normal one but it has like a black border around it as well so i don't know what the hell that means but maybe it just means like they gave me pass for a touchdown drive oh pass for okay so i don't know what it what the black around it means maybe it's that they gave me shit already and no, not to give it to me again or something. I don't know, but I don't know if that has anything to do with anything. Man, I gotta, I gotta find a better playbook. This Patriots playbook sucks. What a big boy. And ten. Here's Bortles. Oh, that's it's a loss of eight there on the first down play. What up, little blue? Actually, if you have more than one. Like, you can't connect your Mutt Rewards, because I have multiple accounts. You can't connect your Mutt Rewards, like, to the other one as well. Ooh, baby, um, you literally have to get, like, another email, create another one, and everything like that. Because on my other account, I don't really play it, like, too often. And I never, like, spend money on it. That's my zero, no money spent account. Uh, it has a completely different email and a completely different Mutt Rewards account. So. Yeah, Blue, we can get a, we can get a share play in, like, later, in a, after a little bit. I just got on, so I'm going to grind out, like, some challenges. But, yeah, we'll definitely, definitely play, for sure. I'll let you in on some of this. Silver Bulldog. You played Madden 19 on the PC, the new one? So I'm going to need y'all to like, drop some likes on, on the video for me. Do me a favor. Drop some likes on the video. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to your boy. I'm trying to do big things this year. And plus, like, you know, I've told, like, a lot of people, like, if you subscribe and everything like that, you can watch my previous videos. I've given away, like, last year, I gave away, and I don't know how much, how much coin, um, but it was well over 10 million worth of coins, so. To my subscribers, so. 
What up, Chris? Good, man. Like, just got on, grinding out some challenges. We're up to an 81 overall squad. That's what's up, Stuck. I appreciate that, man. I'll, I'll subscribe to your stuff, too. All right, you saw the challenge on the screen. I don't need to repeat Trying to get a new it. running so system. Yeah, challenge. bro, like the Mad running Ultimate system team. for me, Go allow less than key. 30 yards rushing in a quarter. The running thing for me is, like, the toughest adjustment, like, so far. This, like, I, I don't know who's, like, sat here and said that uh, this is, like, the old Madden or, like, last year's Madden. This is nothing offense, like last year's Madden. As far as, like, go. graphics and, like, game feel, nothing like it. Like, completely different. Like, everything seems, like, completely down, different. Sides. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line of scrimmage. And no more. I did open a 20-pack. I no got, uh, I didn't get anybody, like, spectacular. I actually did something really stupid, to too, play. which I really like don't care, train, but I, I did open a 20-pack. I got about, uh, nine elites out of the, play. out of the 20. Um, no nobody spectacular. And then the, the elite topper, uh, elite pack Second topper, down. I got, uh, Champ Bailey. Oh, man. Wait, this is a yardage thing, right? I need to be playing different. Was it 30 yards this quarter? What was the, what was the challenge? Oh, did I already lose it because of that? Oh. Let me see the challenge. Um, oh, 30 yards rushing. Oh, shit, I'll just let him score. Was there a fail? Oh, don't allow him to score. Okay. Oh, score at all. All right. Um, yeah, I mean, I agree. I like it because it's completely, it seems completely different. But yeah, opened up 20 packs, got nine elites. At the elite topper, I got Champ Bailey, uh, Legend, uh, 84, and I got Deion Lewis, 82, running back. Um, but nothing else uh, too spectacular. But I did actually make a veteran. <laughs> I decided to go ahead and make a veteran's uh, pack, um, a veteran card. And I got, I was hoping for the 88 overall Matt Ryan. I ended up getting, uh, oh, come on, I pack in front of um, I ended up getting um, 87 overall Pierre Garçon wide receiver, which is probably like the least one that I wanted out of all of them. But it's all good. It's early. And I say the least because, like, legit... Um, I, uh, he has he's 87 overall and he's got 83 speed. It's like what the fuck? <laughs> like my Tyreek Hill, who's an 83 overall, has 91 speed. And you know how like last year in Madden, you could base how well the card's gonna play like in game by the salary cap ranking. You know, so like the higher the salary cap ranking, the overall better. Like play that they're gonna do they're gonna play and my 83 overall Tyree kill has the same salary cap as the 87 Pierre Garçon so it's kind of like yeah that card sucks he catches better and everything like that but 83 speed on an 87 card like no thanks they begin on the ground with Camara. Oh, and he'll take this forward only up to about the seven. Credit him with a one yard gain there to make it second and nine. Well, he hasn't made much of an impact in the running but, game. Yeah, thus I mean, far. first that last run, not much is over 85. So I've got two 85 players. Alvin Kamara and Marcus Joyner. He's my first card. That, what the fuck? Oh, I put on two clock. Uh. He's my first card that's over an 85. So take it. So we're an 81 overall. Which is cool. We almost have uh, a full elite team. Like, I'm only missing like a couple. The center, uh, right guard, and right tackle on offense. And fullback. And then on defense, just a defensive tackle. My second defensive tackle. 
Back near his goal line. Here's Cut. Dude, you see that jump? Bro. <laughs> what the? Who the hell is that KJ Wright? Who is that? I want to see. Look at this Burt, bro. He's just like. Look at that. Wow. That's crazy. Uh, flashback cost me an elite token, two gold tokens, and four uh, silver tokens. I had a couple after pulling, after making that, doing my bundle at the beginning of this video, at the very beginning. Uh, you can roll back and watch it. I pulled like a couple doubles. I had a couple double elites, so it wasn't as painful. But giving up that, uh, that, giving up that, uh, 80, 84, I gave up my 80, 84, uh, Melvin Gordon, which kind of sucked, but I have 85 Melvin Kamara, so that one kind of like sucked. But Pierre Garcon, I got him. He's 87, and he goes for like 100. Like there's only one on auction block right now. He goes for like 175, 175k. Which will probably be more like later. But. Two minutes remain here in the first half. Back to Century Link Field. But yeah, overall, like, this. the team is definitely better. So, we started out like this this year with the uh, 67 or 68 overall. Yeah. Mingo. Like, I don't know, man. These dudes, like, it's so hard to run. But I just got to keep them from getting rushing yards. So I just need to get the clock and trying to turn forward and get some yardage. I really liked what he did there. Because, like, look how high, like, how high they stand when they run. Call it no gain there. And now they're looking at a third and third. I mean, they cut. A little bit better, but well, that was better I don't know. It just seems like it's, yardage, it's one of those things where that sets up a third and long tough spot here. Put it mildly. Sometimes I wonder if some really of that school football should come back so into get play. The line. You know what I would think here? Quick kick. Try and change field position. Help out your team. On third down, here's Camara. And he's got room. Oh, he Ooh, get off. And he'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44. Give him 15 yards on that one, and New England has a first down. Just about up? every coach we talk I'll to says it. the crowd shouldn't affect us. That shouldn't be an issue. And then the next breath they talk about taking out the crowd quick and taking them out of the game. Tyreek, see if we can't get a little yardage. I think we just saw an example of that there, didn't we? It's important to do, especially early in the game like they have. They're able to shake him off. Oh, shit. Not everybody too far. Got it. Ah, come on, Jimmy. Everybody too far for that 80, 80 overall quarterback. <laughs> you did it. You defeated it. Congratulations. We'll see you next time. So at halftime, got an arm it's the like Patriots that. with the advantage. As we'll send you down to Orlando, we check in. Mm -mm -mm. Let's go. So I do appreciate all y'all subscribing and everything like that and liking the videos. Like, you know, stick around. We'll, we'll definitely do some, like, giveaways and things like that. I honestly, if... I probably I would have almost given this to somebody. Actually, I would have given this to someone, this actual version that I'm playing right now. I was going to do a giveaway uh, on this channel for it if... PlayStation didn't refund my, uh, if they didn't refund my, uh, my Hall of Fame edition, because I literally had nothing to do, like, all my friends, they, like, that play Madden, they already had the Hall of Fame edition, so, like, that was literally gonna, like, make you show me that you didn't have it, and I was gonna give it away to somebody. But they gave it to me, so no free, no free copy. We might give a free copy away, like when it comes out. I might buy a digital copy and do a giveaway or something like that, but we'll see.
So it definitely pays to subscribe for sure. Because if anybody awaits, knows me, like there's a lot of like people that are in that here that have been here for a while, like I do give away a lot of stuff. I've like, given away shit from the coins. Time. I've helped people that I've met. I'm supposed to be running, right? Um, I've helped people that I just met. Uh, I like make rookie premier cards for this ten. season. Everything like that. So pretty nice. I'm a nice guy. Now Let's go. Out to get off him. Get off him. <laughs> get 30 yards in three plays. Alright. I'm going to like one more of them. It might be nice. This game is about patience, isn't it? Has had the game he expected, but that run there, that may get him going. I was just going to say, maybe that gives nice. him a little juice, because you're right, he struggled, especially in that first half. Yeah, I know the great get out ones there and block, dude. Just hang get in out there, there and block. Oh, come here. Come here. Let's go. No celebration or nothing, man. Man, they don't even let you celebrate once you do one of these challenges. But see, like that, I don't know. It was it was crazy because like those dudes were swarming on me, but he broke like five tackles in the backfield, no less. Kamara, you a beast, bro. You are a beast. That was pretty legit. <laughs> no lie. That's the thing, is like, I don't know, like the offensive line doesn't seem like they want to block, but the, uh, do not allow any yards one play, that's easy, um, it seems like they don't want to block, but it also seems like the running backs will break tackles quick as shit, so, that was a pretty dope run, I dig it, alright, I'll be right back, I'm turning down the AC. dope run all right so the challenge is laid out in no, front of no, you can no, you complete no, it please. we're about to find out solo challenge Mad okay so i want to see if the glitch is still here so look at the timeouts two timeouts three timeouts if i'm not able to do this and i have to reset it like restart the uh Dude, they the didn't even. Get set oh here for a third down play. Which I'm probably gonna have to do now because. They'll try and run for it with Penny, and the reinforcements Ooh. come in as they're gonna stop Good. him behind the line. Um, All right, nice job. I believe that is challenge met and defeated. It literally Tyson. glitches out and it takes your timeouts away. Good job on this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. Like for both teams, so. It's a little bug glitch that they're going to have to fix. I might show y'all, like, on the next challenge or something like that. I might fail it if it's a quick one, like, on purpose just to show you. But, yeah, it, like, automatically, like, so if it's, like, you have to drive the length of the field and you have, like, three timeouts or, like, whatever, like, um, and you have to restart it because you didn't do, you weren't able to do it. Uh, it literally will take the timeout, say you had three. When you restart it, it takes away all three of your timeouts. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? So pretty crazy. Or at least it was happening last night, I don't know. But I'm sure... Uh, I'm sure it's still there. I'm sure they didn't. They haven't fixed it yet. All right, the challenge is in front of you. Do you accept it? I hope so. Not Keep the game on. on. Play the guys. challenge. It's solo challenge, Madden Ultimate Team. So the passing seems like legit, almost the same. 
Uh, the running. It's just the like at, like post catch, like after you catch the, the ball is what seems to be uh, a little bit more difficult. Now, was this touchdown or was this well, not allowed to go? What was this? I gotta remember what these are. Was the intended <laughs> How about He's unable to complete punt? it there and oh, they're going to go for it anyway. Game that you would expect from yeah, him. He's, He's been four down. off the mark, really start to finish. Yeah, it makes you wonder what exactly is going on. Is he a little bit dinged up here? Or is it just off? Just a little bit. Nope. Daddy can't get daddy. control away. He's taken down. Corey Legion in there to take him down. And the clock will roll. He'll look to throw. Corey Leggett, bro. He's like going ham. At this point in the game, Corey Legion in there to pick up his second sack now of the afternoon. So if you don't know, like, oh, give me that. No. No. Pick six. Ah, you son of a bitch. Lockdown corner. It's like a little receiver. Brandon, offensively, this has been a tough day for him. Usering it is the same. Uh, it's, you know, like at this level, though, like, I mean, as you know, like that was, you know, I didn't use him. I just switched and picked it off. But um, it's a little bit rougher. Like, the Patriots gearing up to go now. They have the lead, obviously, more, late in the blocky. game. I, I guess the good news for them is if for some reason they would make a mistake, a field goal I think this is the year the of the D-line. I mean, I still haven't, like, made it. Uh, made it my mind as to, to what, uh, what I think is the best thing to do. Last year, obviously, it was, like, play middle linebacker and just work people. Um... This year, so far, uh, where's my celebration with my team? There we go. Let's go. Uh, soup kitchen. We got the soup kitchen going, baby. Soup kitchen. Uh, yeah, so usually it's about the same, but... Like the D line, it seems like you're able to get off. Like I said, like if you even watch like the running and stuff like that, uh, it seems like you're able to get off the line like quicker. So like different from last year where you would hold like L uh, R2 down to like get your speed burst like either at the jump of like running the ball or at the jump of on the D line. Instead of holding it down from the beginning, you wait for the ball to be snapped and do it as quick as possible like you don't hold it before, like pre-snap so the jump away. to snap this year is the second of the ball snapped you hit r2 On the return, the whereas last year you could just like Tyler hold r2 at the beginning and yeah, the first off the line but he never got anywhere it would ask you you know line. it always seemed like you got like locked up but you can see here i'm able to like get through the line like a little bit better are you here? Needing to avoid what happened on the last drive, punting the football. Sense of urgency has Cover one hole. Uh, here. beginning of beginning of the season two. The also, I I, way, I would say play play no man. <laughs> I'm going to these challenges. Don't do a lot of them. You guys time. don't see like that. See how quick he got off that line. Um, man seems to be, and that's all Madden though. Uh. Play a lot of man at the beginning, and then once your team gets to about an 85 or above, then you can start doing zone. Because they just don't react to zones that well. You'll see them just getting, like, first and down. Or, like, people will be, like, wide open. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. To throw on third down. Wilson will dump it off to Prosize. And he'll be brought down right at okay. the 30 here. It'll be a pickup of just two. And that'll bring up fourth down. No, he's going to get it off. No. Nice job. Congratulations. Defeating the Madden Ultimate Team. Solo challenge.
that screen goes by like really fast. It loads. That's another thing. I don't know if y'all like if y'all like when you whoever's watching if y'all want to when y'all are watching like the load back like to get out of the game you know after like post game or like whatever is really quick. Like it seems like the loading is like really fast. I don't know if there's it's because like no one's really on the PS4 server for Madden 19. Rush four plus yards every play, three plays. Okay, this shit's getting a little ridiculous now. So I gotta get four yard at least four yards every three plays in a row. So yeah, like watch how quick like The loading like definitely seems to be quicker. The outload to exit the game is hella fast. Like Entering the game, like, it still has, like, a couple screens. It's it's all, it's basically almost the same, or just about the same, I would say. But when you exit the game, like, after you complete the challenge or you restart or, like, whatever, or quit the game, uh, it's really quick. It's really fast to get back to where you were. Patriot offense set to go as they've got it first and ten. This don't look good. Okay, so a perfect example, right? So I'm probably gonna have to restart this. All right, so three timeouts, three timeouts, right? So I just failed that. Now watch, watch what happens when I have to restart here. Look at that. Everybody see that? Now. No timeouts, no timeouts. But the cool thing is if you fail, it automatically like like makes you uh, redo it again. So, that's cool. But yeah, that timeout thing is definitely a glitch. Like, you should definitely be able to... Uh, Definitely be able to have your timeouts and everything exactly the same when it restarts. If you're trying to drive down the field, there's something oh, he's blitzing and I'm fucked. I keep blocking. Now a first down carry. It's Camara. Oh, he's got a little daylight. Again, he finds an open. And he's finally down at the 21 yard line. Good yardage as he rumbles like for 24 out the, the running man, the running noises. I don't care what the game plan Sounds was like coming in. After fish. these runs, <laughs> you're running it, right? <laughs> you, you, you make sure you keep circling on your the play sheet. The dudes in the cutting are, are better. Working, but again, like I said, they're running up the uphill. He kind of like, I don't know, man. Celebrating like I want. For some reason, I'm having a hard time, like, doing crazy shit in the end zone like flips or like whatever <laughs> now watch how quickly you load out so see that screen comes up you don't even get you can't even you don't even have a chance to read it and it's already loaded you out out of the game like look at that it's pretty quick Pass for 15 yards on one play, pass for 30 yards on one play. All right. So we got to pass for 30 yards. So that does remind me, I think, like, uh, when I get bored of doing these solos, I'm probably going to jump in and start doing uh, a long shot thing. I'll start breaking down the long shot video. All right, it's Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. You know the drill. Let's get right down to it. So 
What do we have to do? We have to pass for 30 yards. Mm. Let me just send people to the And the offense will look to convert on third down. Blake Bortles, let's go, son. On third and long, it's Bortles. Is that 30? 30. Give him 30 yards there. And that does it for this Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. You did it. You defeated it. Congratulations. We'll see you next time. But yeah, that loadout screen is definitely uh, definitely different, for sure. Definitely quicker. Loading into the game is the same. Win 20 games! Gold cornerback, hey, we're getting better. We're getting better with the free card, <laughs> the free map card. chemistry pack campaign token pack huh all right so allow fewer than 20 yards on two rams drives and then the next one is score eight points we gotta score a touchdown and a two point all right so 20 yards on two drives so we make them punt we punt it back make them punt And I went for them flashbacks. I didn't get them boy, bad boys. And I wanted that Landon Collins. It would have been nice to have that Landon Collins, man. Doug Baldwin? At least he would have had speed over Pierre Garçon. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, I looked at the stats of the Pierre Garçon, the 87 that I got, and I don't know. It just doesn't seem legit to me. You saw the challenge on the screen. I don't need to repeat it. It's so a challenge. Madden Ultimate Team, go earn your key. Let's see if the the samblet still works. So first and ten of the Rams offense gets ready. Probably not. We'll see. On first down, it's Gurley. <laughs> kind of yard there and now second down we're gonna see wow that play got shut down in a hurry as soon as the snap came you can see defensively they were just closing in that was going nowhere yeah you count on your offensive line to give you a little bit of space a little bit of time so you can make a move there was none there for him to throw on second down is gone oh, a battle for him oh. and this will be caught Bad boy, so nice away. to break the one tackle, but not much daylight after that as he's brought down. He's gonna make that him punt. So. For five. It's third down. He decided to run a hitch route. It really helps have a guy who can turn it loose. And boy, he rifled one in there on that one. Not much run after catch, but it worked really well. Throwing on third. Gone. Go on. Too much juice. It'll be out of bounds. Incomplete. Coverage was excellent downfield. I think he was more throwing that football away than anything else. Yeah, absolutely, because everywhere you looked, they were covered. Sometimes it's better to go ahead and be convinced that there's no place to fit in the football than to go ahead and force it and I'm turn it into a bad play. Fielded just inside the 20. We'll call that a 49-yard punt, but a net of just 39 following the 10-yard return. I will be and back will in a little bit. I'm going to keep playing. Over. I'm going to pick it off. So the Patriots here. coming out now. They trail offense first time to touch the ball in quarter three, and we'll see what they can do. And I can't wait to see what they have planned because some teams script to start a half. Other teams just go, okay, these are the sequence of plays we want to run. These things worked well for us. And sometimes they throw in that big chunk play right away. <laughs> Shocker. <laughs> try and get after them early and try and create a big play to give themselves some momentum. See what they have up their sleeve. 
And a nice job here to down this one right on the five-yard line. So now here are the Rams as their offense comes back out. Now both of these defenses have been stifling these last few drives offensively. Just not able to get anything going. So what needs to change? I think a lot of the guys will go back and review, so to speak, because everyone has someone assigned to. How did each play work? Okay, what did, what did we use that kind of worked for us during this game? Try and get back to some of those plays, as well as the possibility of showing something you haven't shown already in this game and trying to change things up. We'll see if they take the advice of Mr. Davis. On second down, here's Goff. He'll get this complete to Cooper Cup. And he's taken down, but not before he gets this across the 25-yard line. Ah, too bad. Can't win them all, though. Come back, try it. And now the offense getting set, first and ten. Now a play fake here on first down. He's going to leave this for his running back. It's complete. And he will lose yardage and be backed up to the 24. It'll be a loss of a yard, and it'll be second and 11. If you're a selfish player and you're throwing the ball, you're cool with the completion. Maybe not so cool with the yardage loss, though, huh? Yeah, you went, you went backwards on the yardage. Hey, it kind of works like a sack for the defense there. Yeah, it's a really big play for them, right? Able to figure it out. And it goes down. It's a Patriots sack. Jamarcus Lawrence in there to bury him for a loss of 11. And they weren't in zone coverage. They were in man, and each man did his job. And that looked like vintage, old-school coverage, didn't it? Man coverage reminded me of an old Raiders team. They had a Hall of Famer at one corner and a Defensive Player of the Year at the other, and they just locked people down. Now gone. And he overshot him there. It's out of bounds, incomplete. Well, we quit counting yardage on that one, didn't we? That was truly third and a mile, wasn't it? It was. I thought they might just go underneath, but they didn't. They wanted to get the first down there. Yeah, they tried to pick up the huge chunk unsuccessfully. I'm with you. I would have tried to take some yardage just to gain some field position. Take it at the 37. An excellent return that time. 26 yards. I have not done the long shot yet. That's what I was just saying like a little bit ago. With a first and ten on the short side of the field. Once I get tired with this here after a little bit, I'm doing this so late. For their first possession of half number two. Now, if you're a fan of punting, and I know that not many people are, but this game kind of turning into one for you. Long shot. It's okay if it's a skills contest. Set a long shot video. But not during the course of an actual game. This has turned into a field position game. Woo, coffin corner. Sometimes a better punter may actually determine the outcome. But no, I have not done it yet. I will get to it today. A lot of to go today. It's gonna be a long day. Have to go at least 50, 60 yards here if they want to ensure that they don't have to punt the ball like they did last time. Yeah, so what you're saying is. But it's good to know, like Sam. Right, you're playing to make sure Sam Blitz still works. Field again, so it's not picking up a couple of first downs. You want to pick up five or six first downs and make sure you move the ball to their territory. Now it's Gurley. That's dope. Sure, all these challenges and stuff. Just a yard on the pickup there, and it'll bring up a second and nine. That first down play, all you want to do is wedge out any type of space and try and create enough room that you have to run the punter out there. You can successfully complete the punt. Damn, I didn't get a no, you son bitch. He almost broke it. He's going to take this up past the 10 to about the 11. Give him six yards on the carry. It's going to be third and three now. They're trying to show that they can run the ball, protect this lead, give it to the backs, play a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy and at this point. Make that defense stand up and stop. Go. Oh, fumble. Oh, my God. He got a first down, too, because of that. <laughs> that's shitty, bro. <laughs> that's shitty. Now he's going to get a chance to actually, like, 
No way! Fucking what? Wow, bro. Okay, he's got five more yards to get. Okay, two first downs on that shit. Yeah, playing me is going to be a little bit later on, man. I'm going to be grinding out some of these solos and shit like that. Like, I want to get, get into it a little bit. I mean, playing other people is cool and everything like that, but there's plenty more days to come before it's even released. So we'll either get to it like later, later tonight or but you gotta figure now they're uh, gonna maybe see tomorrow more or something people like that. stacked up in the line we're definitely scrimmage. like over the weekend but we'll definitely play I can, we can probably, we'll play today but it'll be a little bit later on here comes a 20th carry for Gurley and he is gonna be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage they'll lose a yard and it brings up third and this is why I accept your friend's quest for yesterday right Look little blue in this situation partner what was your PS thing? Long distance situation. Do you run it again and trust your defense and make sure you take care of the ball, punt it away? Well, can we get a stop here so I can hear this fucking challenge already? Trying to do it. Sam Blitz still kind of works. We'll see. Third and long. It's gold. It's a short one here, complete to his tight end. Yeah, what was your uh, what was your PS thing? They get only four that time as that leads us to a fourth down. Yeah, doing it. I hate to surrender the football when yeah, you're nursing a slim lead, but they're going to have to punt it away. Trust that defense. It's the right play at this stage of the game as well. You don't need to press it here because you do have that little bit of a cushion, and you count on your D to make it stand up. On is the punter, Hecker, as he gets this one away. Down. Yeah, he was looking for the checkup bounce, didn't get it. That scoots all the way into the end zone now for a touchback. So that does it. Put this one in the books. A successful Madden Ultimate Team solo challenge. How about whenever I get See bored doing time. these solos, I'll let you uh, jump on with me. I'll stop uh, streaming. I'll let you jump on with me. We'll play, play around a little bit, and then I'll jump back on stream and do the uh, long shot. So we'll we'll play like in between. Still a Ram chemistry. This pack contains enough Ram players to activate a tier one team chemistry. This will add plus one strength to all the Rams players in your lineup. Add more Rams players to your lineup to receive additional boosts. Okay. But it's all silver players, I'm sure. Oh, one word. Nah, DTS this is the full version, bro. Neither. I'm just watching getting high. <laughs> That's what's up, Lil. Is there even a 10-hour? I didn't even know there was a 10-hour trial. I didn't even know that that was even a thing. But no, this is the full version. All right, score. So we got to score touchdown, two-point conversion. Uh, 
Uh, there's a 10 hour trial on Xbox. Is that the early access thing? You only get 10 hours of it? Or is that the full game? Okay. Yeah, so this is on, this is PlayStation. So it's like one of the few that are PlayStation. It's not Xbox. You got early access and it's still not, what the fuck? The Rams were able to take the lead on their last drive, but you have a chance to take it back. Right so is the EA here. access, the EA early access, is, that's only 10 hours? They're only allowed to do this shit for 10 hours? I thought they actually got the full thing for... And the offense getting set as they've got it first and goal for the Wow, team. so literally the oh shit. I didn't know it was this close. Um I didn't know the EA access was only ten hours. So you only have like ten hours to like play and then it's like well fuck first you. Down, and this is caught. Touchdown, huh. That's a five yard touchdown. And the yeah, so DDS, this is, I got this from Mutt Rewards. They sent me an email yesterday at noon giving me the full game. And I had already bought the Hall of Fame edition. I was waiting like everybody else. Uh, they had given me the, uh, um, the beta test already. And then I did that, gave them some feedback, like whatever. And then they gave me the full, they gave me a code. And so I refunded my Hall of Fame edition. And uh, oh, he's good. I refunded my Hall of Fame edition, uploaded this, or, or like, put the code in that they gave me, and it unlocked the full game for me. So yeah, I've been, I haven't been, I've only been playing it like a few, maybe about like five hours total, like four or five yesterday, and like only like two, one or two today. But yeah, it's the full version, man. What do you mean you can glitch it with a dummy account? What do you mean by that? Like an alternate account? So like if you if you download it and play on, on EA Access and you have like another account, you just switch your user and log like and then go back to the to the game, it'll it'll be unlocked for full. Oh, so if you buy the Hall of Fame edition and you have like a, a different user, like another account basically, you can get the bundle, the Hall of Fame bundle for both accounts. Yeah, because it probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference. I can understand that. Okay. Campaign token. Check this out real quick, then yeah, I'll make a party real quick. Or I'll just I'll just jump on with you. Add campaign taken to the offense or defensive campaign hero sets. Use this item to navigate uh, actions menu to navigate sets from the main menu. Alright. I'll be right back. Yo. What up? I don't know, but yeah, bro. It's like um, I was watching a video on that shit. Like, cause they always do. They do it like every year for people with Xbox. They got the EA Access app. And well, yeah, I know it. that. I know that because they do that. Uh, because they have that shit with Microsoft, and like that's why PlayStation always gets fucked over, because Xbox always gets that shit early. Right, PlayStation didn't want them. They declined it. They said that he had access shit. They said that shit's bad for business. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. But um, basically, what they do is like after they play their ten hours, you basically just make another dummy account, and when you when you open it, like as long as it's primary, your EA access is still like connected to it. So you open like you open the Madden again from the dummy account, but it's like as soon as you open it, you just switch accounts. And once you switch accounts, some kind of way. It's like you're using the 10 hours from your dummy account, 
but it'll allow you to load up your your primary account that you normally play on, and like all your stats and stuff will still be there, and you can just keep going. So oh, basically, shit. just keep using dummy accounts up until the game comes out. <laughs> Once nah. ten hours up, you delete that account and just make another. Oh hell yeah! I mean, it would suck though. You have to keep making like a million, yeah, that's the only a, thing, a like, million, a million can... fucking accounts. <laughs> right. <laughs> you have like fifteen damn like twenty accounts just to get through that like seven day period. <laughs> right. But then again, I mean, if you did it, like, you'd still get, like, free shit, and you could just trade it all to, like, one account, like, just log in, get your free shit, and then, you know. Yeah, yeah, that's true. What's this up? Are you live? Can you, do you have uh, your audio put onto the stream? Uh, I think so. Because it probably sounds like I'm just, like, talking to myself right now. <laughs> I probably sound like... Nah, that's, look, that's, that's another reason. I'm like, make a party, bro. I'm like, like I'm typing and it just seems like you're talking to yourself. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, anybody that's in chat, like, like they can see it. You know what I mean? They can see that I'm responding to you or, like, whatever. And to them. Oh, yeah, I can. I but can it's just... It. I thought about it. I had my voice on share because I be streaming and shit all the time. So as long as they, like, see. Let me turn it up real quick. But it's just okay, yeah, you on there. That's what's up. Well, good then. Hopefully, like, uh, they heard what's what's crack packs? The crack packs, King John said, crack packs. Would you get some free crack out of these hoes? What <laughs> you look like Dave Chappelle and shit up in this motherfucker. Do not allow more than two completed passes. I don't even know how many like challenges I've done. 18. Yeah, this shit. It's another guy I was checking out earlier. He did like, I know he did the whatever challenge that is down at the end, the diamond challenge. I think it's like 32 of them. And it's one right next to it with like, like 83 challenges he did all of them i'm like damn man you've been crying bro <laughs> yeah that's a lot especially i mean well a lot of people that knew because like when i got this shit yesterday like i didn't know that like i said and i've explained it like a million times when everybody jumps in and asks like i didn't know this was actually gonna like unlock it like to play it you know what i mean like i thought right like they basically were just giving it to me for free and i had already paid like the 71 dollars for the for the you know hall of fame edition so i was like well, well fuck it i'll just at least get my money back you know and i still gotta wait but at least i'm gonna get my 77 dollars like with tax and whatever at least i get that back and i'll still wait you know right and like so i they actually gave me the refund and i was like oh hell yeah because i didn't think they were going to and if they didn't i was just going to do a giveaway oh, they would, you, know, you know you know what would have been crazy though if they hadn't given me the refund right I would have been still sitting here not playing, and I would have gave this copy to like one of my subs who didn't have it already, like had uh, like already right. bought, already bought it, and they asses right. would have been able to play it right now, like I, <laughs> while I'm sitting there like can't play. Man, I didn't. They fucked me yesterday. I didn't like. I knew about the you know the policy for returning pre order, but yeah. I didn't know about the 14 day policy. So oh. I called I called yesterday and after I sat on the phone for like forty five minutes they finally answered. And I like I pre ordered the standard edition like as soon as they put it up. And then I noticed that they put like a small sale on the Hall of Fame edition. I'm mm -hmm. like, fuck, that's like twenty more bucks. Mm -hmm. I'm like, why not just get the Hall of Fame edition? So I called yesterday trying to get my money back. And I was like, you know, I could just get the Hall of Fame edition. And the lady was trying to do it and I guess she realized it. she was like, Something's not working. I'm like, What you mean? <laughs> and she was like, uh, oh, okay, I realize it. you had it too long. She was like, you know, you, been, you purchased it like so long ago. And she was like, we can't refund it because you like passed the policy. I'm like, you're a bitch. Mm. That sucks. Well, um, I didn't even know like any of that shit, like any of the policies or anything about exchanging like until, see, I was, until I was yesterday when I went to go do it because I was like, fuck. And I started looking on the internet, and it was like, oh, you can't, they don't exchange shit, like, ever. And I'm like, oh, fuck, like, I'm going to end up, like, stuck with this, and then I'm going to have an extra version. I was like, oh, fuck it, I'll give it away. But I went See, online. See, what they're going to do is, people like, people like you, who they gave this version to, like, they gave you, like, a standard version. So, the day of the All normal right, release, which is the or whatever, yeah. um, they're going to put out, like, a Hall of Fame bundle. So basically, 
the same shit, like Mike just in case you did out. want the Hall of Fame version, but you're playing this version, it's yeah. almost like you'll still get the Hall of Fame version. You're just going to buy all the shit that comes with it. Yeah, you're going to pay that like $20 or whatever it is for the... Right, right. and I said, fuck it, I've been waiting just to get this. Here are the Chargers yeah. now yeah. as they get set to go on first and ten. Yeah, because they're not going to... Like, and, and like, I actually didn't even know that, like, Mutt Rewards and everything like that. I mean, I knew they gave me the, uh, the beta test for it. Ooh, and, like, that was shit was out of the blue. And I was like, all right, hell yeah. So I played it for, like, you know, two, three weeks. And then... Bro, you had to be winning, like, a gang of games and shit, bro. Because they said they give the beta to fucking like pro players and competitive players. Do you, bro, you don't match well, 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 see, the, the, the thing is... Bro, it's always well, close. Yeah, well, see, the thing is, like, I used to be, like, pro Madden, like, back in the day. Like, not anymore, though. Like, okay. like before, like, it was, like, hyped up and shit. You know what I mean? Like, right. Like, before, like, the shit's on ESPN and all this shit and everything now. But, like, that still, I don't, I don't even know how that would even affect unless they just, like, went into my account. Because it's not like I said, hey... You know, when I logged, I made my mutt rewards thing. I was like, "Hey, I used to be a pro player." Like, blah blah blah. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> so like they, I don't know, but yeah, they gave me the beta, and like I played it and new level challenge. Hold on, let me use Patrick real quick. Uniform upgrade pack. Let's go. Okay. So find a gold uniform in your item binder and use the actions menu to upgrade it. All right. Does that take training too? Because I do have a Patriots. Level master collectible 14. What's that? Okay. I'm back out. Check out what the hell that is. Alright. Yeah, so I didn't even know, like, when they gave me the beta and everything like that, I didn't even know nothing about it, right? Like, I just happened to, I just happened to check my email. Like, it came across on my phone, and it said, like, EA, blah, blah, blah. I was like, what the hell? And I That's what at, they said, bro. They said and, they just sent them out in emails. <laughs> yeah, and, like... I was like, what the hell? So, like, I uh, went into it, and it gave me a code, just like it gave me a code for this one. It gave me a code saying um, that you've been, congratulations, you've been rewarded the closed beta testing of Mad 19. You can't stream it. Uh, I made a video on it, like, when it came out, because I couldn't, like, stream it, I couldn't show any of it, I couldn't show screenshots of it, I couldn't do anything. Right, you, know? you could only play it. <laughs> yeah, and, and basically all they wanted me to do was, like, report, like, feedback to them, basically saying what was glitchy about the game and shit like that. And there's more, I've seen more glitches in this from me playing this than... Did you know what I, you know what I heard, bro? Like, mm -hmm. they said with the beta... They, they sent people to this website for feedback, but they say the reason that they gave it to mostly pro players and competitive players, because they know one thing, they're going to go and find all the OP cheesy shit, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying, in the game. Right. And they're going to, because they say, like, if you look on Twitter, bro, like, during the beta, bro, those guys were already competing for, like, leaderboards and shit. They were playing each other. Oh, so, yeah. of course, they had already found the cheesy shit. Oh, yeah, no and doubt. what it is, is, bro, it's like a system. That basically sends all like community stats to EA, and they look at it like basically what's being used the most, what's the most like what's the most packages are being used, how many yeah. how many times a bunch being used, like mm -hmm. what's what's getting them the most sacks, like what's what's yeah. creating the most errors, basically shit like that, so that around the release date they can tone the settings down. Yeah, exactly. No, <laughs> and make exactly them find right. something else. Yeah, you're exactly right. <laughs> That's why I was like doing some of the the plays and stuff that, like last year. You know, like, you know, Gun Bunch and, like, uh, the uh, the goal line, like, Sam Blitz, you know. And those right. plays, those plays like, still work. You know what I mean? That's why I was like, oh, shit. Like, these challenges will be easy because it's basically right. the same 
the same uh, like broken ass plays that were broken last year are still broken this year. So it's like, all right, well, this will be right. And that's what they that's what they're looking for. The plays that are being used over and over and over and are generating, you know, a lot of yards and shit like that and, and touchdowns and shit. They're gonna tone them down. <laughs> yeah. So it's not as easy. But that's a good thing though. Oh, I agree. Cause I hate I hate fucking glitchy plays. I think you should actually have to have stick work and be able to play. That's right, why I like. Bro. That's why like you know people you know they're like oh I need to have a, a 95 overall team and I need to do this and I need to have you know the best like squad. It's like dude I'll beat you at 81. With your 90, with, bro, bro, which bro, which you your, which your ninety right which your ninety two overall team I will beat you with an eighty one and bro, I will embarrass you, you put it on YouTube and like make you look bad. You took the words right out of my mouth, bro. Because I had I pulled away from Madden for a few years and then I kind of I was kind of you know you know iffy last year mm. and like I ended up just buying like I bought it and then I like, I didn't want it no more so I sent it back to GameStop and then around the end of the year I was bored so I just bought it again anyway. And I started my ultimate team like super late. So like right now, 18, bro, my ultimate team has an 81 offense. Bro, I beat 99s with my 81 offense. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I totally agree. Yeah, I'm like, this I'm like, yeah, I have to have the skill. I can understand you have all these OP players, but if you ain't got the skill, you can still be beat. <laughs> yeah, cause, I mean, if you you play it, like when you play in Madden 19 and you play and you're going to get about a month into it, and all you're going to see is like when, when you play people head to head, you're just gonna see the same that person running the same like three plays, bro. Bro, that's I all they do. Like that, and it's like once you plays. once you shut those three plays down, it's like interception, interception, they interception, they interception. Because right. they, they don't know punch. what to do. Because they're like, well, shit. Because they go to a random play, and they don't know where the receivers are going. They don't know what right. the people are doing. They don't bro, know how to audible out of it. You know. And bro, it's I like, noticed that bro. like every. Every year, bro, like there's people like that only have four plays in their whole entire playbook. Yeah, there's people that run one defense the entire game. If you run one defense on me, I'm gonna demoralize you. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, there's only, there are certain like like last year, like I know like a lot of the pro players and everything like that. You basically ran, you know, like one defensive set, but you audible. They run cover two the entire game. You know what I mean, and you can change, right. and you can change it up. What these, what normal people don't know is like they just see somebody playing that or picking that play, and they leave it like that. So then they're beat right. with a with a post over the middle, and they're like, well, what the hell? That don't happen to the pros, and that don't happen to you know. It's because like they're audibling like five different players in that same right. formation, depending on how you're coming out and the way you look. You know what I mean? So it's like they normally take like that middle linebacker like in a cover right, two so the and they'll drop him back right like it's almost you, like a three deep like cover three. Right. So and so by the time like that linebacker starts tough. dropping Let's back go. in that like, you know, four second window, he's literally covering the entire middle of the field as he's just dropping back. Right. <laughs> and like and people are looking at it like, oh, shit, like. <laughs> How do I handle this? Because like that middle linebacker is just steady all the over the place in the middle of the field. First down and ten. But they don't realize and know audibles and like how to do all that. So once you know, my advice to like anybody is exactly what you're talking about is like get that stick work. Like, like yeah. learn the audible, learn the like you know what like what plays like basically like people do over and over and over and yeah learn how to use learn how to use hot routes and yeah motion exactly to your advantage. Mm -hmm. manipulate the defense <laughs> it's just like football but people play it like it's a video game and this is the way it's like i mean it is video bro, game but play this shit it like it's real it like bro i have to like what you're saying right now i in so many different games i try to explain that to people i'm like bro you grew up in the world of arcade like video games Bro, don't play video games like arcade style no more. Everything's a simulation. Play it like you're actually out there. Mm -hmm. You're gonna prevail. <laughs> anyway. And that's the difference between not even pro players, just like above average Madden players. And just like your normal, hey, I'm picking up the sticks and let's play some Madden. You know? Right. Like, I don't know how many people, like, they'll be like, because I don't even talk shit. You can beat me. Like, people can beat me. It's not like I don't get beat, you know, or like whatever, but it's. Like, the thing is that you're going to have to, like, actually work. You know what I mean? You ain't going to just, like, sit here and, like, throw bombs and do dumb shit. And I'm just going to be like, okay, there you go. Good job. You know. Right. 
Like, right. But that's basically that's how I play, bro. Like, you're not going to drive the field on me in three plays. Yeah, exactly. It's going to be greedy and ever. It's going to be ugly, bro. <laughs> you better, yeah, you better keep running that mesh and, like, getting the yeah, like three, that's, that's three to five-yard like, passes because that's about all you go get. That's why I tell people, like, when you play me, bro, don't expect to play action bomb down the field like every play, bro. I'm going to go three, four, five-yard plays on you. <laughs> right. <laughs> but that's football. <laughs> like That's football, bro. And then as soon as you come up and they're like, all right, well, you're going to keep running this mess, then you drop it over the top. And it's like, Smooth thing by all means. That's it. That's why like, I don't understand like, when people like talk shit and like, oh, I've been playing Madden for like four years. I, I'll be there. I'll be there. All my friends and then they'll play me and they'll lose like 30 to nothing. And they're like, oh, you, you like, so like you play, you play too much. Like you must play on the game too much. Like, no, dude, you just ran the same four plays. Like, just, and your friends didn't, and your friends didn't know how to, your friends didn't know how to stop them. It's like last year with those out routes, those quick out routes. That, like, everybody would just keep throwing because your corners, like, even though they would react, they'd be 99 corners. And even though they would react, they'd if you, if you yeah, uh, they're backing up. And they take that one step right. back, and then you just throw it throw it out there. And it's like, you can do that play the entire game, and people don't know how to stop it. And they just get frustrated and quit. And it's like, bro, all you got to do is, like, one audible, and, like, you'll cover that. Make me do something right. else. Yeah, it's stupid. Like, if people, like, literally, like, learned to, like, play the game instead of just playing it to play it. Playing the game, right. Yeah, <laughs> instead of, like, playing it just to play it and then sit there and, like, get mad because, like, they play other people. That's why if you notice, like, a lot of people, they don't get, like, the Sean Taylor, like, Mutt Masters. They don't get the, you know, where you have to beat people, like, head to head. Right. Because they can't, they can beat the computer like all day. Like I'm sitting here, like not even paying attention, and I'm doing all these challenges. Well, you can do this all day, but it doesn't make you like good at what you know at playing Madden. Right, right. It don't make you better. And so, like when you go in and they play head to head, and they're like, "Oh shit, I gotta win 150 head to head games," and it takes them like the entire year to do it. <laughs> you know, and it's like right. they're waiting for that dude to quit or some shit. I don't even know what the challenge was for this. Rush for five yards on one plane. Yeah, I don't know. But, yeah, well, you definitely true on pretty much like everything you're saying. It's, it's, it's pretty pretty crazy. The craziest part is like they think they're good. That's the, the crazy part. I don't know how many people I've heard that talk shit. And it's like, what? Toss play, Camara. Room here to run. Just passed him at the 45. Oof. Right Let's go. I think he's going to go. Man, there I go. Him. Dirty. Touchdown, New England. Yeah, that does it for this one. Pat yourself on the back. Yeah, running backs definitely going like, to break a lot of tackles. The Madden Ultimate Team solo Bro, challenge. is the spin move still like OP? I've seen you spinning and it looks different the, now. The t well, I'm just doing, I'm not doing tight spin. My, like, uh my uh l2 trigger broke so i can't do i can't do tight spin okay so it's kind of that long drawn out like lazy spin move because <laughs> i hated that shit last year man people were spinning and they would like spin hella wide <laughs> yeah yeah it's because they're not holding down l2 you hold down l2 and do it like he'll be like shoop like in this one, apparently I haven't been able to do it because my L2 is broken. I'm getting a new controller this weekend, but what is, like you can literally, you it, some of them will literally like spin like in place, like old school Barry Sanders where he just like runs, stop, right. <laughs> and he'll be like whoop and like literally spin and not even move, like his body won't even move. He'll just spin in a circle, and it's like what the hell? How do you do the um like the one cut shit? The what now? Like the one cut shit with the running back, the new shit. Like where he plant his foot in the ground. Uh, it's just like uh, that's the the R one. Like it's just like okay. if, I figured, it's, I kinda figured it's, it. Like you know how like you do like with receivers, like if you're running a route and like you you hold down like R one and then you right you do either, a, like do a sharp cut. Yeah, you either do a sharp cut or you do a post or like whatever up into an angle. Yeah, 
It's basically like okay. basically. I figured it would be something like that. Yeah, it's basically the same thing, but for the offense for the first back. and ten. But they run, I don't know, man. Like, they run so high. Like, it's definitely going to take, like, adjustments to, like, running. Like, they just sit there, and it's like they're almost, like, they're not crouching down at all. You know what I mean? You expect the running back to be, like, kind of low and... It's, just, it's like they're just running, like standing up. Well, this is how you shake the thoughts just, of that interception on the legit. last drive. You come out and start this one four for four. And watching him throw it around with that type of confidence. For but, of like, they break a lot of tackles. You're either going to get tackled for, like, a loss or after you start a game, or you're going to, like, break the shit for, like, at least, like, ten yards. Stupid. Bortles now on first down. Throw left side complete. It's Graham. And he'll be taken down at the 44. There's a lot of glitches I've found so far. There, Crazy. Eight yards of the first down completion. Facing a second and two after that last catch. Good for eight yards. I'm sure they won't be sure that out, but... Portals to throw on second down. Looking left side and he's got a man. That's Graham. And he is out of bounds. Just like that timeout shit that I was talking about. I don't know if you were on like when I was talking about it. Um, I was like, I was in and out then. I was fucking with shit, but I heard you say something about a juice where it takes all your time out. I was trying to figure out what you were talking about. Yeah, so like on these challenges, right? Like any challenge, you know how like if you fuck it up or like whatever. Like say it's just run the ball for five yards and you don't get it, right? And you have to restart the challenge. Right. Without backing all the way out and like going back into it, you just restart it, right? Well, when you just when you restart the challenge, it automatically takes away all your timeouts and the other team's timeouts. Like it's like That's a crazy. it's like a glitch that it just takes them all away, and it's like what the fuck. So like if it's like one of those things where you've got twenty seconds and you've got to go eighty yards, but you have three timeouts. If you try to reset it and redo it, you're going to end up with no timeouts, and you're not going to be able to do it. You know what I mean? You have to literally back all the way out of it and go all the way back into it. I was watching this video. This guy, he was in, like, career mode. He was playing with, um, um, is it, is it Zakeem or Shaquille? The Griffin guy that just got drafted to Seattle. He's missing the hand. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, fuck, I forget his name. Yeah, he had him, bro. I was just looking at, you know, he had a lot of different video clips and shit. And the shit actually looked kind of cool, but it just tripped me out when he caught the interception and he was running with the ball. With it, he had the ball in his hand that has no hand. <laughs> oh yeah, I saw that video too. I saw that. I actually saw yeah. that before. I actually saw that before, like when the beta like came out. Like somebody had went to, like, as they had that EA, you know, like whatever, like not Comic Con. Yeah, the but, EA plays it. Yeah, like the E games or like whatever, and like people, right? Like, people had went and they were playing it, and uh. Yeah, someone like took a screenshot of it, of the ball like in an old boy's hand, and it was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I was watching the video, bro, where he got all the different clips and shit, and like it was all good until he like until he intercepted the ball. I'm like, oh my goodness, they got him with the ball in his left hand, <laughs> and he has no left hand. <laughs> oh shit, that's funny. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. I didn't see the video of it, but I saw like the I saw a screenshot of it. Where it was yeah, then he, it, then he, like, like, when he scored the touchdown, it was pick six. When he scored, he held the ball up in his hand, and he, like, he held oh, it up no. in the, on the nub. Like, <laughs> he was, like, sitting on top of the nub. Oh, I'm my like, God. I'm like, what is this fuck? I'm like, they should really edit him. He should not put the ball in his left hand mm. at all. That's awesome. I laugh my ass off at that shit. It's like, I don't watch him play a game of games. Like, he can... He could, he uses it well. He could cuff the ball with it, but like he definitely can't, can't yeah. hold the ball. With it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've seen him catch interceptions, bro. Yeah, like well, like you, have you seen that uh, that new UFC uh, fighter? He's like like fifteen and zero or something like that, and he's only got oh, one, and he's only got like uh, like basically. Like, right after his elbow, like, his arm stops, and he's got, like, little, wow. like, deformity, like, like, because you still see little nub fingertips, but it's just, like, little nub, you know, like, little balls, basically, and his hand's just, like. And he's 15 and 0? And he's 15 and 0 in, like, I think wow. it's, like, I, I think it's, like, middleweight or something like that. Bro, wow. he, he literally, <laughs> he literally, like, chokes out people, like, with his arm, with that arm. 
Like it's it's hey, crazy you know to watch. Bro, like he'll, he'll that, sit there I, and just I bet be that like, one arm is like super strong. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying it has to be. <laughs> but I'm like, how you gonna get it strong like that? You know what I mean? Like, what you how you right. how you put? I guess tie weights onto it or something. I don't know. But yeah, dude's like 15 and 0, and like I've seen him like he punches with it, even though it, like, I don't know. Like it's crazy to watch. But oh boy, he's he's, he's raw. Yeah, check him out. Man. Like I think he's in like the next uh, UFC coming up. The next one coming up. Um, I wonder. I gotta get the game back. Man, I wonder if they added him in the UFC three because they edit in like new fighters and they just put people in who actually aren't on the game but are actual fighters. Mm. And I took it back because I didn't like it because I was so used to two and I was so big on two. And yeah. it's like it's they slowed it down. Like it's, for some reason, just two just seems better. So I got mad and I took it back. <laughs> yeah, this cat's cold. Like he's in that next that uh, TJ Dillashaw and what's his name fight. The one that's coming up on the fourth, I think, this Saturday actually. He's the, he's one of the, like the undercards like in it. Yeah, yeah, check him out. But yeah, I was like, oh shit! I thought it was a joke, and then I saw the dude's record, and like, and then they started showing like, <laughs> and then they started like showing highlights of him, and like, I was like, oh shit! He's like choking his cat out with like a nub arm. Like, he's, like, rear naked choke, like, with that arm. Like, and that's the arm that's, like, the underhook. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Man, I don't know. Bad dude, though. All right, it's Madden Ultimate Team Solo Challenge. You know the drill. Let's get right down to it. But, yeah, that linebacker, that dude that you're talking about, like, he's quick. He's the fastest I've seen, bro. Like, I haven't he, seen a linebacker that fast. Like, yeah, like that's why it's like he has receiver speed. Yeah, he has world class receiver speed. Yeah, well, I mean that's why he got drafted. And shit. Cause, I mean, I'm, I know he can like catch you know interceptions and stuff like that. I'm sure it's a lot more difficult. But the dude's like lightning fast. I was like, Holy yeah, bro, shit. he's like, lightning, I, he's like, lightning fast, and and listen, he has no hand. But it doesn't take a hand to tackle. All it takes is arms. Wrap up. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> but yeah, I watched his like like some of his combine and then like some of his highlights and like yeah, he was like the fastest like linebacker. And then like he was like top, uh, I think it was like five, in like all everybody like including the receivers. I was like, it was crazy. I don't know why because I know like it was so many people scared to take a chance on him. I kept telling my brother, I said, bro, I don't know why I feel like his brother is talking to somebody in Seattle and Seattle is going to draft him. I looked at the draft, bro, when I seen it, said Seattle picked him <laughs> up, I like to die, bro. <laughs> yeah. I said, you get his brother, I said, you get his brother with your number one draft pick one year and in the very next year, his brother comes in with a special story. Why not get him? <laughs> yeah, for sure. I mean, that's what happened like with a lot of people like, uh, look at like Gronk with the Pats, like, like his brother, uh, he was a fullback. Didn't nobody want him? Cause I mean, you got to be a, a a beast fullback to get drafted. You know what I mean? Right. And like nobody wanted him, and so the Pats picked him up just cause Gronk was the tight end on the team, and it was already you know it was like one of those all right well right we already got you you know we already got your brother so we'll give you a shot i mean he didn't he made the team but he never played or nothing like that and he ended up getting traded but he's still in the league but bro yeah, i want that to you bro <laughs> a good amount of time still left on the it's only did you see the stats for it all these hall of fame like oh. like all the they're trash all the hall of fame like players that you get to pick out of the five you know or whatever like all trash. of all of them are like 80 overalls and they have like like T.O. has like 70s, like I don't know, it's like, wow, yeah, it's so bad. But you can, I mean, you can cheer it up, but like to start, yeah, it's bad, dude. I was like, oh, like they can be trained. Yeah, you can, like, I, I like a lot of these dudes, like you can, you can level them all up and make them better. But I mean, you're giving, you're, you're highlighting, that's the highlight of the, like, I mean, shit, it's on the cover art. You know, where, oh, you get to pick right. a one of five Hall of Fame, and they're, like, 80 overalls, and the only one that's, like, has even half-ass decent stats is you know, Woodson. 
Rod Woodson. That's crazy. Like, T.O.'s literally got, like, 76 speed or some shit. I'm like, what the fuck? Chemistry Pick my damn other one. Hey, how do you get those um those training points? Ah, uh, you quick sell cards. Oh, okay. So like, like most like your nat players or like whatever, like you you quick sell them, and like it gives you like okay. training it gives you like training points and everything like that. So. I'm not sure if the Nat players, let me look, I can look, I just got one. Yeah, see, like, so this Nat gold player that I just got, the quarterback, Brock Osweiler, like, you can quick sell him. He's not auctionable, not tradable. He can go into sets, too, but, like, you can quick sell him for eight, okay, training, yeah, see, eight, see, eight, eight, eight training points. So. But, so, like, the higher the player, obviously, the better the... Like the more training right. points you finna get out of them, and you also get them in like solos and shit. But because I think I'm gonna look, but I'm pretty sure like that Pierre Garcon, like his was like a hundred and hundred and seventy or some shit. Like that. Oops, I didn't mean to like look at it. That card's going for hundred and seventy-five k. <laughs> Ooh, so yeah, so that that eighty-seven Pierre Garcon, like you can sell it, quick sell it for seven hundred and seventy-five training points. Which, oh, is a, cool. which is a lot of training points. Because it didn't take like a ton to like upgrade some of these dudes. Let's see where we at on these challenges. Man, I don't know how these people like just be grinding all the way through this shit. Man, that'd be the only thing, bro. I get bored, I have to go do something else. Yeah, like, that's what I was saying. Like, it, it, it eventually, like, at a certain point, it's just like, okay, like, what the hell do you do now? What's up, Gutsy? Right, past 30 yards. Wow, less than 10 rushing yards allowed to. I mean, the, the packs are getting better, at least. Yeah, I think the main thing for, like, this year is going to be figuring out, like, who to actually, you know, like, level up. Like, what player to actually level up, you know. Right. And, like, like who you're going to get the best out of. You know what I mean? It's like figuring out, like... Like, right now, like, I would sit there and probably, like, level up, uh, like, Tyree Kill. Because the dude's an 83. And he's got 91 speed. <laughs> right. So it's like, you know, that dude's fire. And she's just, like, upgrade him. But see, you can only upgrade it once and it just gives him a chemistry slot so that kind of sucks oh okay but maybe it's just because he's a gnat i don't know let me see if like somebody else that's not a gnat like has um, let me see here let's look at al camara because this is the part that like i have no yeah see he only goes up one but see what I'm guessing is like you probably you you know you upgrade him his upgrade path is only like one thing like right now but I'm guessing like as like the season goes on like when he gets like if Alvin Kamara when Alvin Kamara gets like a a 91 card or something like that then okay. you then you probably add that card with this one you know what I mean 
Yeah, and they're just like up. The, just like the tear ups last year, but like you can, mm -hmm. but with these you can actually reverse it, so you can go all you can break the cards all the way back down. So like if you did boost him all the way up to like say it's a ninety nine and it took you like four cards to like do it, like and and some training points, you basically would lose your training points, but you could back it all the way back out and get all four of those cards back. Unlike okay, cool. unlike last year where once you made that ninety nine. That's it. It's locked in, and you've got that ninety nine. You you can't right. you can't go back and get that that eighty five, that ninety one, that ninety four, and the ninety eight that it took to make that ninety nine. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. I have to figure out like what like the best way is to like upgrade these cats and like you know. I don't even know, can you even boost these? You know, if you can upgrade Pierre Garçon, you can just give him a chemistry slot, but it doesn't boost him any. It's like five points. Do you want to upgrade for trainers? Like, let's just try it. So we'll upgrade. Upgraded it. We gave him a chemistry slot. And then select an offensive scheme. Oh, shit, okay. Balanced O, catching, carrying. He definitely needs speed. So, spin move, juke, running, pass, throw, power, catching. So ain't none of them got speed. Catching, carrying. I guess it'd be like go deep, maybe. Throw power. That the right stick down, bro. The speed might be in tier three or something. Yeah, that's what I don't even see. Is that right, press the right stick down. I mm -hmm. just yeah, I just did with the other one. There you go. Yeah, speed ain't even in any one of them. Balanced, uh -huh. balanced. Oh, spin move, run block, truck, blocking, catching traffic, stamina, none of that. Power. Yeah, running. I see no speed. <laughs> yeah, I don't see any like plus speed anywhere. Zone run, spin move, juke, elusiveness, run block, juke. Maybe, maybe it's not. Maybe they. they no. I was about to say maybe it's run, but I don't even think it would be run. I don't even know. We'll just give him, give him balanced though, maybe. You don't need no. Don't run. Catch. Give him West Coast. He seems like a West Coast cat. So now can you go back? Yeah, see, that's all you can do. You basically just do that. But then how do you... Yeah, and see, then you can go back. So it took me five points to get that. And see now I can like I can take that back out and change it to something else if I wanted to later, but I'm only getting two training points back, so I'm losing three. Oh, okay. So whatever you decide to do, you can always like go back and change it, which is dope. Just cost a little bit. Yeah, which is dope because I mean if you decide like to shift up your team, you can make everybody be West Coast offense and all have that chemistry boost for it. And if you don't like it, then you can just change it all to like something different. Or, cool. or like once you find out what's broken as fuck, <laughs> then you go back in and change it. Requires 30 players. Because that's the other thing about this too this year is like all your backup players count too. Okay. So like, like last year it was just like all your starting players. Like this year... All your backup players and everything like that, they all count towards uh, towards your chemistry. That's why it said like to get to like to like tier five, it took like twenty players or something like that. Ain't no twenty players like starting on offense or even on or even like in the backups. So it's basically like right. you, you just have them fools like in your binder <laughs> and then they count towards your chemistry. Trying to play squads. Are we able to play squads like 
And uh, how do we... I don't say are you, are you able to find a game? <laughs> Ain't that many people playing. <laughs> well, yeah, that's what I tried to do when I first, like, after I I got them cards, like, I tried to, like, play. I actually got an easy one earlier. I got one of these earlier. That's why it says one more win, because I won one. But I tried to get into either one of these, and, yeah, it was like a two-minute wait, and I finally just said, fuck it. Maybe somebody's in there now. And I'm even putting it as play as any role. Where I should probably be like, I'll play offense or whatever, but because I probably have a better offense than anybody in here. Hey, they say this year, like, we can take, like, like, we can squad up, but we can do, like, solo challenges and shit. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, see, that would make it, that would make it not so boring to grind solos. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Well, because I wanted to do these because this is part of like a challenge that you have to complete. Is you got to do it like an easy, a medium, and a hard. And like, and then it gives you like, you know, it's one of your objectives or like whatever. So I want to try to knock these out, but I can't find nobody that's got the balls to do anything but easy. And I already did that. It's just because they don't want to play in all Madden. Right. Like, cause That's it, the only way I know. Because <laughs> they, they don't got the sticks to, to do it. So it's like, all right, well, I can't. I got an 81 overall team. I can't be all Madden squad. It's like, yeah, you can. You just got to pick the damn yeah, play. Yeah, Pick the right shit. It's artificial intelligence. It's artificial. It's not real. <laughs> yeah, <right. I'm> <laughs> Exactly. Well, that's why they can't beat it, because they do the same plays over and over. <laughs> exactly. And, it's and, it, and, 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 and the it. AI is designed to stop you from doing that. So it's like, right. well, if that's all you know how to do, then that's why you can't play all Madden. I, I mess with people like that all the time. I'm like, bro, how do you let artificial intelligence outsmart you? It's artificial, bro. It's fake. <laughs> <laughs> it's going off of what you do. So if you ain't mixing it up, then it's over. But that's the problem. They just do the same, like, plays. And then the computer is like, next thing you know, after the third time, the computer picks it off. Exactly. First couple gonna, first couple times, you're going to get that, like, 15 me. yards. You're going to get that 10 <laughs> yards or the 30 yards and everything like that. Gotta, it's like, hell yeah. And then the third time you, gotta, you try to yeah. do that shit, it's like, pick six. And they're like, what the fuck? And it's like, because the motherfucker's just waiting for you to do it again. You just told the computer basically that you're gonna. This is what you're gonna do. <laughs> if you're gonna play a football game against me and you tell me I'm gonna throw deep every play, I'm gonna pick the ball off. The Texans took the early lead with a solid right. opening drive that resulted in a touchdown. Because I know. Play, the the <laughs> yeah, because I know you're not gonna run the ball, so I ain't gotta prep for that. <laughs> Right. If I do for a fact, you're not going to run the ball. I want to try me, okay? <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> I want all the defensive backs on the field. Bortles now on first down. Got it. He's going to float this Got one it. deep right side. And it's caught in the tail. Oh, so close as he takes it all the way to the two-yard line. You okay? Great job. You wasted no time getting okay. downfield on this yeah, drive. We lost I got him. Mm -hmm. I got him. Hey, my hand. Uh oh. Uh oh. Alright, how about after this, uh. <laughs> after this, uh. This set of challenges, we'll jump in and. We'll, we'll, we'll get some, we'll play some. Ain't, ain't too many. Like four. A lot less than 10 rushing yards and allow two or fewer completed passes. So just stop them on, don't give them a first down basically. Hey man, I have high hopes for NBA Live every year, and they fuck it up every year. <laughs> it gets worse and worse. That shit Bro, used they... to, that shit used to be 
like on point back in the day. Like that, that, was shit, that was like the game before like 2K and like all that shit. That was the game. Like that was like, it was like, hell yeah. Like you got live. Yep. Just got that new live. Let's go. And like, all right, you saw the challenge on the screen. <laughs> they just, I don't know. Every it's year it gets worse and worse and worse. And worse. Go earn your key. I was like, man, what the hell are y'all doing, bro? <laughs> what are y'all doing with y'all money? <laughs> Especially when you know, like, 2K is, like, basically just taking over, like, you know, basketball and stuff like that. Like, why would... Like, it's so crazy. It's so crazy, you adjust? like, y'all allowed 2K to take over, and then y'all y'all just, like, got passive and allowed them to get lazy, because 2K is hella lazy now. They just want our money. They're like, fuck, you the only number, you the number one basketball game. You're going to buy it anyway, if you like that. Yep. So we can do what we want to do, and you're going to buy it. Yeah, why would you allow them to do that? If you know they're doing it, beat them out. That's that's why like Madden's like the same way. Like no one, the no same one, way, bro. No one competes. The same way. No, one, there's no game that comes out and competes with Madden. And mark my, mark and so, my like, words, bro. They know you're gonna buy it. You're gonna do it. If EA, if EA keep being lazy and keep being lazy, bro, they're gonna let 2K go back into developing that damn ESPN football, and they're gonna beat them, bro. They're gonna put their foot on their neck, and they're gonna put them all the way out of business. True. Because that was like I I I told you tonight, bro. I kind of liked the day football game. Yeah. Like, cause they had uh, what was that one that like when Madden like first became popular? I think it was like um, an NFL Game Day. I think. Listen, bro. Listen, I'll never forget that. That's like one of my favorites of all time. PlayStation One, NFL Game Day '98. Yeah. It's real big. It's on the cover. Yeah, bro. Yeah, <laughs> that was the shit. To this day, like, bro, to this and... day, that game has the coldest stiff arm known to man. <laughs> <laughs> like it was the shit. And then like Madden just took off, and Game Day was like, "Man, something special here on third and long yep. after that." And took off. Because it used to be huh? like, what was what was better? You know, like, because people would be arguing, like, oh, game day, like, cold it, like, you know, game day right. better. And, like, that was the argument. It was, man, it was game day and game breaker versus Madden and NCAA. Yo, <laughs> pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, it's sad. Because, like, now it's just a monopoly. Like you said, like, you know, Madden's got this. And until somebody decides to step up, and you're right. When somebody does, and it's decent, it's going to cause problems. Yeah. Because men, like, they lazy. They know right now we're the only football game that can compete. Mm -hmm. That's why they use, like, the same cover art, like, card art and shit, like, year in, right. year out sometimes. Like, they don't change shit up because they know they already got it. So why why bother? Like, 2K they got so lazy, bro. They just copy and paste games now, bro. They copy and paste games. Mm -hmm. Same with you the mechanics. Yep. Boom, there you go. Charge your arm and leg. That's why, like, everybody last year was, like, pissed off because, like, people were talking about boycott and Madden and everything like that because they changed, like, literally almost nothing from, like, 17 to 18. Right, they just threw another game out. And, like, like they didn't change the mechanics. They didn't change, like, anything. Like, all the play, like, everything was the same. This year? The like, thing they did last year was long shot. <laughs> yeah, but that's what, like, their, like, oh, we got this new hotness, you know, <laughs> thing was. It's like, oh, we created long shot, and we've got this, you know. But they didn't do anything to, like, change the game besides, like, make the graphics better. But this year, they right, actually put in work. And, like, Can you fulfill that solo challenge? Time to find out. It's, it's, it's definitely a different feel, for sure. And it's Madden Ultimate Team time. Hey, I just see something that says reach tackles, bro. I love to play on defensive line. So now, are you telling me that if I'm being held on the block right and the running back is running right past me, I can reach out now and grab him? Mm-hmm. Bro, I've been waiting on that forever and ever and ever. <laughs> bro, you know how many tackles that I know I'm supposed to get? Because I'm like, this is not realistic, bro. You can't run past me like that, bro. I know I can reach my hand out and grab you. Yeah. You slow you down while you're running through the hole. And you're not giving me a holding penalty. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, how can I not reach out and grab this dude and I'm right. not, like, and I'm not getting like, a holding penalty? You, you running right past me. I can't at least grab your jersey and slow you down. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's my best friend. He, like, played uh, defensive end for Rice. And he literally like tore his entire shoulder apart doing that. Like running back, out. running back was like he was you know locked up like on lineman, and like 
running back like literally like ran right right next to him. He just reached out, grabbed the cat, but the he running back on. and like and he and he slammed him down, but the running back like you know hyper extended his arm backwards and like tore his whole shoulder apart. But it's like I mean that's legit. That's real shit. Hey look, <laughs> my old lady looking at the screen. She the paper. <laughs> she pointing. She like yeah, they cheat. <laughs> nah, why you got to do me like that? <laughs> Come on now. Oh, you a big Patriots man? Yeah, that's my that's my squad. Oh yeah, man. Well, during the season, we gonna be into it, bro. Cause I hate them motherfuckers. I'm a Seahawks fan. Bro. <laughs> oh shit, man. You you definitely mad. <laughs> yeah, but you I should be you like, see, the thing is though, you should be mad at your own team for that shit, not at the Pats. Bro, bro, if somebody y'all won, y'all won that damn game. Like y'all, but y'all also lost that team. damn game. <laughs> Listen, bro, there is someone behind the scenes sabotaging the scene, bro. That's exactly why my son Lynch said, "Hey, you know what? I don't want to play football no more. Oh, next year, you know what? I want to play again, but I'm only gonna play for the Raiders. That's why." Hell, uh, uh, Richard Sherman told him, well, y'all want to let me go, go ahead and let me go. I don't care. Like, it's something going on there, bro. <laughs> you talking about, like, at Seattle? Yeah, something's going on in there, bro. Like, behind the scenes. I mean, I'll be honest with you. When I saw, like, y'all, like, I mean, you got beast mode. The dude averages, like, in, inside, inside the 10-yard line, every time, like, throughout the season, they gave him the ball 80% of the time. Bro, and then, he and, was... <laughs> He and, was so pissed. And he got man. there too. Like he was pissed, bro. He I he, he killed me with his like with the way he talked. And they interviewed him a while back after this shit. He was like, man, it's one yard, man. You need a ball, man. Yeah. <laughs> I mean it's true though. Like, bro, it's one yard. Who on this earth can stop me from getting one, one yard? One yard, exactly. One but yard. But you gonna you gonna throw it twice. <laughs> right. Like you have me and you don't even attempt to give it to me? Like, Seriously? Listen, even with my even the even the goofy shit my old lady just said. The quarterback sneak. The quarterbacks, I would have rather tried that. I would have rather had Honestly, that's what I like I, in, honestly bro. that's what I thought like when, when it was down there and everything like that. That's what I was that's actually I thought, what I was looking for. I thought the first <laughs> I thought the first play was gonna be Marshawn Lynch like straight up the middle. And then when they, they tried to pass and they fucked it off, like I was like, okay. So they either gonna do like a scramble out, like roll out, like and and quarterbacks bro, right and let him walk right in the end zone and like and let him run and let him run if it in. That field, bro, there was an opening. He could have walked in the end zone, bro. Yeah, he that it was a huge it gap. Perfect. There was like a fifteen yard field. <laughs> bro, it looks, it looks purposely like it looks like he purposely <laughs> threw that interception, bro. <laughs> yeah, because there was nobody on the left side of the field. If he had just like walked to the left, oh, like nobody was even over right there. In. Mm-hmm. And it's Russell Wilson too, so it's not like we're talking about. Most, we're not not like we're talking about Tom Brady or some shit. Like right. Right. where it's gonna you take him like ten minutes to get up to ten miles an hour. Using your leg, and you don't even attempt. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, I agree with you. That's why I think like everybody was like shocked. You put the like, game in the hands of the no-name receiver. <laughs> I was like, sitting, I was like, literally like sitting there like, fuck. Like when y'all got down there, I was like, man, this fucking game is over. I was pissed. I was mad. Like even bro, before it happened, like I was just bro, like I had made a I had made a bet, bro. I was picking up my money. Mm-hmm. Bro, we threw the interception. Do you know what he did? He reached his hand down and he actually popped my hand like a child and was like, "Hey, put that back." That's fucking hilarious. But I was crying. He said, like, "Get your head out the cookie hurt. jar." Yeah, right. <laughs> I was hurt, bro. <laughs> That's funny as fuck. <laughs> Yeah, that was bad, 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 bad. There's like so many things that should have changed, but I'll take it. It's a win. Oh no! Oh, they popped up on pot. Yeah. <laughs> Antonio Brown look like. All right, so the challenge is Antonio laid out in front shit. of you. Can you complete it? <laughs> We're about to find out. Solo like so challenge, busy. Madden Ultimate Team time. Let's go. I wonder what they're gonna do with Jalen Ramsey so with this car. Yeah, like, so, like 
I think I saw his core elite, and it's only like a 86 or 87 or something like that. I was like, really? I was like, you talking about like the best corner in the league, right? Like, you just completed. Like him and I like him, bro. I like, I like him and AJ, 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 AJ Bouye too. Like, I mean, he's nice. He's nice. And he's like that cat that like they're throwing at Ramsey because they don't want to throw to Bouye. I, I seen the guy get Bouye out of pack, bro. He um he did those diamond solo. Yeah. And when he finished, you know, they let you, like, pick a team. And he mm. picked Jacksonville. He got, like, four elite, and he got a Bouye. But the Damn. Bouye was, like, seven, I think. Oof. Did you hear about uh, uh, Leonard Fournette? Oh, what happened? So, like, these, like, him and the beef with Madden. Like, so, so basically, when they released the stats for, like, like all the players for Madden 19, mm -hmm. right? Like... Clearly, like, they've, like, last year, everything was, like, super boosted. Everybody was, like, hella fast, and it made the game, like, really hard to play. Like, like, because where we're talking about, like, I could beat you with a, an, a, an 85 overall team if you had a 95 overall team. Like, right. you couldn't do that last year. There's, like, no way. Like, the computer, right, the computer, yeah, the computer would just destroy you no matter what. You know what <laughs> like I mean? Like, the sliders were too high. Yeah, and so basically this year what they did was basically they took everybody's levels and brought them down, and you're going to have to upgrade your player to make them, you know, your specific player that you want and upgrade them and make them better. You know what I mean? But your I base, like but the base card, and I agree, but the base card is, you know, it's kind of trash. You know what I mean? And so, like, they're relying on you to basically upgrade. That's the whole thing this year is their damn training points. Right, upgrade, I seen you last them. night. I seen you last night when you upgrading that, um, what was it, Steve Young, I think. Yeah. So it's like I took him from, like, a 75 or 73 or something like that and put him up to yeah, an 80. I, yeah, because he was, like, super low, and I seen you boost him to an 80. Because I had no, like, quarterback. So I was like, fuck, I need a quarterback if I'm going to do these challenges. But, yeah, so, like... Um, uh, Leonard Fournette, like when it came out, I think he ended up with like an 83 overall card or something like that. Oh, he didn't like that. And he got pissed. Like I literally, been, he took to Twitter and he was like, fuck Madden and all this like da 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 da. And then he sent, literally sent an email to Madden, like, or to EA. Do not allow any yards to consider. Um, he sent an email to EA complaining, saying, I think it's disrespectful that you gave me an 83 overall card. Like, I'm better than, you know, I'm top 10 in the league in rushing. You know, I should be, right. at I should at least be up in like the, you know, 87, 86, you know, but he was looking at last year's cards, you know, so like there were base elites that were 90s, you know what I mean? Like right. thi like this year, there's no base elite that's like 90. Or I mean, there is, but there's probably like one, or like two, because I think Antonio Brown, who's the damn cover athlete, is only an 89. Like, so so, so basically, like toned, basically kinda, all the tone down everybody's overall. Everybody's, and like so even like uh, I don't think that's a bad thing. No, I don't either. And like even Marshawn Lattimore and and uh, like Alvin Kamara, you know, rookie of the year is like respect is the offense and defense uh, they basically only are 85s and, and you know what bro that could be like reason being like maybe later on down the line this year in the game that could be like you know what we're looking at as 83 or 82 what we're thinking probably you know with the mind frame from last year thinking how he's gonna play he may play way better yeah that's the thing. Like a 99, and, like that's the thing. It may be so hard to get 99 in here, and you may get 99, and they're gonna actually play like 99. <laughs> mm. So he sent he sent out an email like to them. He says this is special, blah blah blah, blah yada yada yada. And they were like, okay, well this is what we've done this year, you know, so on and so forth. And then the the, the end of the the email from EA response from EA was like. If you feel the need to send us a video 
proving that you deserve a higher ranking, our professional uh, statisticians will review it and and possibly change it if they deem necessary. What they, hold on, what they need by video, bro? What they want? Put it. They want him. They wanted him to basically. The EA literally told him to send them. Send, <laughs> Send them highlights of Leonard Fournette's rookie year last him, year. I would have told him, turn on your TV. <laughs> That's like literally like, and he was like, I can't believe these fools just told me to like send them a video of me playing, me playing football last year. He's like, isn't this Madden? Don't y'all, isn't this all y'all do to like prepare for this? Is like watch video and watch how y'all talking about like how. You've got real motion and everything like that this year. You get that from yeah. literally like yeah, watching videos. So how did you, you know. Y'all y'all got real motion. Y'all obviously don't have my real motion. here, <laughs> right? Which but you yeah. should because I'm a top back in the league. Yeah. And so. You should have my running style. <laughs> and so which he everyone, just, look, which the whole world loves right now. Yes, you should have my running style. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he like literally got pissed off. So he, he uh, boycotted Madden. He's like, I'm not playing that. Extreme Madden, he's like trying to get everybody like on board and like stop playing that. <laughs> I was like, that's some funny shit. You gotta mo I mean, the thing is though, let's be honest about it. Like, it is a video game, you know. And for you to be in preseason, like getting ready for the start of preseason, this was like two two weeks ago, something like that. Getting ready for your NFL, your second NFL season. And the main thing that you worried about and crying about is your beginning rank. I was just going to say, bro, and it's the beginning of the season. It's the beginning of the Madden season, bro. Once they update, if you perform, you will up your overall. They'll give you that, yeah, they'll give you that 93 card that's like, oh shit, everybody wants it, you know? Like, <laughs> so it's like basically they, I mean, they're right in saying like, through to us like throughout the season that you know we'll give you the card like, if Saquon like if Saquon performs this year uh, he's, yeah. to, he's gonna have a super super card around the middle of the year you yeah know? yeah he'll easily have like a 93 like by like November right because I fully expect him to rush for 15 months. Like that, I see it, bro. I fully I expect it. him to like rush for 1500 this year. Like no question. That's why whenever we're talking about doing rookie premieres, I was like, if you do one, do drink one. That's it. I think they're gonna fly on the radar and do something this year, man. Cause like they got nobody else. I mean, what you gonna do? You got you got a wicked passing game with Evan Ingram, with Odell, all of them. Right. And then you never had a running game, so they got screwed over. Now, you've got like a beast. Now you got now you running got something back. to lean on. Exactly. So, yeah, I think he's gonna I think he's gonna tear shit up because you've got to protect against Ingram, who's the fastest tight end in the league, and you've got to protect against Odell if he I stays if think, he stays healthy. Like, I think Cleveland could have landed him though, bro. I think I still think they messed up on this. I think Cleveland could have landed him, bro. If they'd have picked him first. I think they still could have landed him and Baker. I think Baker would have been still on the board at three. Oh, I do, too. Him, I do, too. The Giants, the Giants wouldn't have got him, bro. Like, easily, easily, like, Cleveland, like, r biggest retard decision, in my personal opinion. I think what they tried to do, I think they tried to get Baker first and come back and get him at three. There's no way in hell he was going to be still on the board at three. No. He was going to one. He should have went right. one. Right. He was going one or two. That's why, that's, why the the that, the that's why the Giants were like, hell yes. Cause they didn't want no Baker Mayfield. Yeah, like when they, I don't like, even think Baker. Class, I don't even think. I don't even think Baker Mayfield he, is gonna be like the best rookie quarterback. This year. Bro, he was surprised when they called his name first. <laughs> yeah, literally. Cause I you're talking. I guarantee you, Joe you, Nuggets and the Giants. Cause said, you're talking him. <laughs> well, cause you yeah, it's for real. Cause you and you're also talking about the Cleveland Browns who have had like the. Like what top five pick like the past like bro, eight, eight years in a row or something? Bro, the past the past twenty one or twenty two years, bro, they've had nineteen or twenty different starting quarterbacks. Yeah. <laughs> and it's <laughs> like why do y'all keep like like get just go get you a quarterback like Kirk Cousins, you know, or something like 
Do like, you think about, about the city of Cleveland, bro? No matter what kind of hype you got, as far as a quarterback, if you do not perform, they're going to stick you up, chew you out, and boo you out of the bridge and get you out of here you don't want to. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I, I, no didn't actually, <laughs> I didn't actually know. I actually found out from playing this. That I, I didn't know Deshaun Kaiser, who was a rookie last year, Cleveland's first-round pick. Like, I didn't know that – or second or, – or was he mid – Mid first round or maybe uh, maybe it's their second round. I, I know Garrett. I know Miles Garrett was like their first, the first pick. But like, I think they had two in the first round. But either way, he was like second round pick. Uh, they literally cut him. Like when they signed Baker Mayfield, like they literally already cut Deshaun Kaiser and they traded him to uh, Green Bay. I, that's, that's crazy. Man. I was like, this kid was a rookie last year, got uh, bro, thrown, got, got got thrown into Cleveland of all spots. Right, right. just threw him in and, the fire. And and <laughs> and then you're like, oh, you suck. You got to go. It's like what? You got to go. Hey, bro, they so uh, fucked up. Bro. <laughs> like I I literally hope that like you know Aaron. Rod I mean, I don't wish ill will on anybody, but I hope like Aaron Rodgers. Like goes down with some sort of injury or something like that, and Deshaun Kaiser like comes bro, into so Green Bay gets, so and just like just, show, yeah, bro. just tears shit up and just yeah, like just I hope he chance, plays bro. I hope he plays Cleveland or some shit and like goes head to head and like just rips them right. apart and just be like nah, it wasn't me, it was your shitty team. It's like Cleveland gave you one chance, bro. Like we got one year, show us what you can do. If not your ass is out of here. <laughs> Yeah, and especially they like if you, money. and especially if you think about Cleveland too, like like last year their defense was nice, their defense is gonna be better this year. Their offense, they got uh, Josh Gordon back. Have no offensive line. Thomas, who's like like first ballot Hall of Famer, like left tackle, blindside, like beast, went down before the season even started. Like. Or in the first game or some shit like that. So he had, like, nobody to, like, protect him. And then they're like, oh, right. you, su you suck. I was like, dude. I'd be like, let me go, please. Just let me go. They fuck over him, bro. <laughs> I'm like, I don't even want to be here. Let me go. I'm good. All right, so let me stop this stream. Say goodbye to everybody for a little bit. It's off. Hope you all enjoyed everything. Chill, my boy, Blue. Uh, We will be back later. Or I'll be back later. We'll figure this yeah, shit I'm out. Old, but going, we might do some uh, long shots or we might come back and do something else. But I can't play with my boy and stream at the same time. So I'm going to take a little break, play around, uh, let some people. I actually, like, I've had a ton of people, like, ask me, can I, like, play, like, with you, you know, just to play. But but we're going to play a little games, uh, let him get get his hands on some stuff and play around get the feel for it and everything like that and uh we will be back later or i'll be back later catch y'all